Good evening, good morning, good day, good afternoon, everybody all around the world, no matter where you're from. I think I got all the bases covered. As you can see, I had an assistant this evening. Oh, okay. Been in a rush, been in a rush, been in a rush. Okay. Uh, and the phone ain't quit. The mouse ain't quit. He looks calm, but he's really not. He's wanting his two seconds of fame. All right. And I think I got most of this set up. So, we will go here and see, kill that. We go to default view and we change this to live chat. And then we pop out chat and put it where I can see it. Yeehaw, I think I'm actually there. And uh, only technically three minutes late. Four minutes late. Cut me some slack here. I had, like I said, I had help. All right. Uh, let's see. It doesn't look like we're doing too bad on lag. Yes, Ron. Yes, Rocket. Yes, I love you too, Sue. All right. And let's see what we got going on here as soon as I can get a hand free. Dude, I've already had a bath. Yes, I have already had a bath. Uh-huh. Now, have you had your, have you had your fame tonight? Hmm? Had you had your moment of fame? You gonna let me do this? Oh, okay. Now you're bored since I'm holding you still. Oh, okay. Just a minute ago, he was being a leg climber, wanting his attention. And let's see. Hello again, everyone. I believe I'm actually here. What we got here? First in the gate tonight. Uh-oh, the competition has changed hands. Diamond Painting with Gammy. Good evening and welcome to you. First in the door, followed by Mutt Nuts Crazy World. Oh, uh, let's see. Diamond Painting with Gammy, Diamond Painting with Gammy, Mutt Nut, Mutt Nut, Diamond Painting with Gammy. Tijuana, good evening to you. A.K.A. Karina. I got to remember to start including that. <laughs> Love and Sparkles, good evening to you. How's everybody doing? Uh, let's see. Sandy, hey, you're in early tonight. I take it you've already got Greg and dinner situated and all that good stuff. How are you doing? Uh, let's see. Billy A, good evening and welcome in to you. Uh, let's see. Colleen Fisher, good evening. Welcome back. Glad you've been in the house. Oh, let's see. And down the list, we start going. Okay. Oh, let's see. Diamond Hunt, Gammy, Love and Sparkle, Gammy, Mutt Nut, Love and Sparkle, Sandy, Sandy. Oh, let's see. Sandy, you got your diamond painting. You got your painting today. You're not specifying diamond painting, but I'm assuming it says such. What'd you get? Uh, let's see. Scott S., I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Yes, I know the feeling, Scott. I do, too. Yes, I am here. I'm here. I'm here. Uh, let's see. I've managed to sleep most of the day away and catch up from the week's endeavors. And quite honestly, feel like I could still go back to bed like I didn't finish catching up. But it is what it is. Dealing with it. Oh, uh, let's see. I think I finally got woke up here in the last, oh, I want to say 40 minutes now. Anyway, and that was after three cups of coffee. Oh, uh, let's see. Mutt Nut, Love and Sparkle, Sam Pam Gammy, Raylene Prather. Good evening and welcome back. Oh, uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. Scott, that's good to hear. Uh, Deb Gossman, good evening and welcome. Glad to see you in the house. Oh, uh, let's see. Sandy, we're going. You're going out to dinner. Are you going to take us with you, Sandy? Where are you going to dinner at tonight? What's 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 for dinner? Uh, let's see. Jen M, good evening to you. Uh, and welcome back. Let's... Rocket, you have done had your 15 minutes of fame, dude. Leave my ankles alone. Aaron Colley, good evening and welcome. Glad to see you. Uh, let's see. Oh, Sandy, you got Alice. Alice is a very cool one. I like Alice. 
Oh, uh, let's see. That's crazy. Dreamers Craft Corner. Hey, Linda, how are you doing tonight? Glad to see you. Rocket, dude, really? What are you doing? Mischief Mouse. Oh, uh, let's see. Scott S. In the process of moving. I do not envy you there, Scott. I am not moving again. We have moved enough in our lifetimes. Oh, uh, let's see. Yes, Linda, your rain is headed my way. It's supposed to be here in a couple hours. Although we've had two days of pretty much nothing but rainy weather. Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, to, to, to Karen Lewis, hi. Sandy Chin, Olive Garden. Olive Garden was all right. Uh, to me, they've gone a little downhill of late, but uh, then again, we haven't been there in a while. Uh, used to, we liked them, but I don't know. Oh, uh, I know the last time we went, it seemed like everything had either some type of cheese or Alfredo. I could be wrong. They could have changed their menu. I do not know. Oh, uh, let's see what we got here. Uh, oh, okay. I'm already at the bottom of my list. Interesting. Let's see what we got. Top chat. How did that change? That's supposed to be live chat. Oh, uh, let's see. Raylene, I will take rain over snow, trade it. Well, actually, Raylene, if you go by all of the so-called forecastables out there, whether it be Farmer's Almanac or what have you, we are supposed to be in for a very wet winter. Now, wet meaning both rain and snow. Now, keep in mind that for 10 years now, uh, well, it's been 10 years since we had any significant amount of snow. However, we are being forecasted to have a very wet and cold winter. So now, they're saying half rain, half snow. So it could be interesting, especially come January or February, because uh, that's when we tend to get most of it here. I don't know, this uh, El Nino or whatever that's out in the Pacific is supposed to be influencing us directly. And we're right on the line this year as far as forecasting between a mixture of rain and snow. Either way, it's going to be a cold, cloudy, wet, ucky winter for us. And it actually kind of started off early temperature wise. We've already had frost warnings early this month, as a matter of fact. So, and I know that the next, uh, for the next week here is supposed to be pretty much cold and wet, but not cold enough for snow, thankfully. Just cold rain, basically. Oh, a high of 25. Okay, so where might you be at, Raylene? I don't remember. Uh, let's see. Oh, let's see. Hello there, Cindy. Uh, I should say, I think we've got multiple Cindy's in tonight again. So I will be more specific. And Cindy Michelle of Diamond Painting Fanatics. Good welcome to you from across the pond. Oh, let's see. Scott is sick of sunshine and wants some rain. Be careful what you wish for, Scott. Uh, if I remember right, you're more of like the desert southwest. Correct me if I'm wrong. So you could very well wind up with uh, floods. And floods in the desert southwest, while rain may be welcome, floods are not. So, uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. Montana. Yes. Yes. Okay, Raylene, you're in Montana. That would explain that. Uh, but then again, you're in a region that gets a lot of snow. So, oh, uh, you could very well be one of those that has the white Christmas. I would not, would not uh, be surprised. Uh, let's see. Jen M. Yes, Cindy Michelle, she, she comes to stir the pot. I think she enjoys it. I can see that nice big smile on her face whenever she does. So... Uh-oh, 
I have, I have somebody else in the house, which I've got to go make her Dr. Pepper for her for tonight. Oh, uh, let's see. Yes, Tijuana. Okay, all desert. I, yeah, been there, actually. And I know the area. Drove through, didn't like it, kept going. Oh, uh, let's see. Well, actually, I visited multiple times when I was in the service because I was there in 29 Palms. And Tijuana was one of the go-to places. Oh, uh, let's see. All right. Are we ready? I'm ready. You're ready. Okay. I am ready to turn over the controls. I'm not ready, but I'm here. Okay. Well, who we got? Oh, uh, did have, did have Rocket, but I think he finally gave up and decided to leave me alone. He was in ankle mode. So there you go. Y'all have fun. I will be nearby. Here's Nix. <laughs> That's the only thing he was messing with. Here's Johnny. Hi, gang. Oh, I'm here. Tonight is a Bon Jovi night. Yes, Bon Jovi. Uh, I knew you were here somewhere, Rocket. Oh, guys. Hi. Hello. Uh, oh, this is one of these nights. Hello, Risa. Hello, Aaron. Uh, hello, uh, Raylene Prather, Scott S, uh, Diamond Painting with Gimme, hello, 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 Jen M, Diamond Painting, uh, Diamond Painting Fanatics, hello, 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 Risa Young, much love, my darling, thank you for your YouTube support, uh, Aaron Colley, um, Sandy Chan, hello, my darling, Karen Lewis, Deb Gooseman, um, Brandy Stevens, uh, Linda, Dreamers Craft Corners, hello, 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 uh, Jen M, Colleen Fisher, Cindy, Loving Sparkles, Risa Young, if I didn't say, oh, I think I already said it, but there's an extra heart, there's an extra, and thank you for your YouTube support, um, if y'all will notice the little star by Risa Young, uh, Risa Young's name, um, that is because she joined the YouTube channel and is a YouTube supporter, which, by the way, I figured out and have managed to get into the wheel of the giveaways. So now uh, my YouTube uh, subscribers are now in the giveaway. Uh, and that finally all got fixed and worked out. And um, so I wanted to say a huge, huge thank you to everybody uh in youtube uh if you look below in the show more section you will notice that your name is there uh in the youtube uh sponsor section um and let's see we got love and sparkles i got a ferret come on it, dude you get your little fat little took us up there come on all right there you go all right Everybody knows that this is Rocket. Hello, Rocket. Okay. All right. Anyway, um, and so, uh, yeah, and Risa, your name is below in the show more section. Anybody that supports uh, the YouTube channel, Phoenix Fantasy, Nix's Notions, uh, in any type of monetary gain, your name is listed below in the show more section. No, you don't need to be. Where are you going? Okay. You're not climbing on my hat. All right. You, you, I don't think you can wear it. I think it's a little too big. Hi. You're not helping back there. Uh, so, anyway, we have Bonnie, Northern Texas. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, Aaron Colley. Uh, I believe I've spread your name. Reese, I done said your name three or four times. I done got, I done figured that out. Okay, so uh, I don't know if it's a holiday or what is going on, but uh, we've been a little slow this week. 
Now, first thing I got to tell you guys is uh, I honestly am not going to tell you how long we're going to be here tonight. I feel like crud. Um, I don't know if I didn't get in. This week has been like a massive, crazy uh, work week. Like, no joke. I think I got like maybe six hours for the whole week and I fell asleep in the chair. But, uh, anyway, uh, thank you. And you put the color name on it. Thank you. That does help. Um, anyway, uh, you're not helping, dude. Okay, we're playing Let's Go Around, Merry Go Around Mama here. Uh, Sandy Chan, hello, my darling. Mada, hello, my darling. Uh, so anyway, um, and, uh, I don't know what's going on with me. I feel like I just didn't get enough sleep or I'm just, honestly, I'm tired. But I ha I got a crazy bunch of good junk done. So I uh, got a lot of putties made. I'm going to be showing y'all this evening. Still got about another 50 to go. Um, got all of the uh, winter months coming uh, guys, I am going to be rotating out, uh, putties, where are you go? Well, get your butt up here. I'm going to be rotating out putties, going with the Christmas and holiday, uh, themes and what have you. Um, somebody asked for a cucumber melon and a cinnamon apple uh yes on the cinnamon apple i'm working on that and the cucumber melon is the only thing is i cannot for the life of me figure out what to put on the top of the lid for the cucumber melon so uh that is you know i have it uh, i just gotta find a little little gidget thing to go on the top or the bottle y'all know how i put all the stuff uh, stuff on the top Bonnie, Northern Texas. Hello, hello. Um, Diamond Pam gave me. I, I, I just woke up. I mean, I really did. But I, I don't know if I didn't get enough sleep or if it's just it is. It was a long week. It was a long week of. Uh, excuse me. Of. Um, just honestly, just cranking it out. So, I've got new colors. Um, I, I've got three new colors to show you guys. Uh, I got a whole new set to show you guys. Uh, I've got one, two, three, four. I got five new putties that are going to be going up. I'm so, so, so sorry. I overslept today. I had full intentions on getting up around 2 o'clock, getting pictures done, and getting those posted on the site. Um, it just didn't happen. It, it just it it just did not happen. And I ended up waking up around 5.30. Um, excuse me one second. Sweetie? Mia? Can I have my Dr. Pepper, please? Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Love you. Your job's not in here, is it? Uh, no. Uh, my coffee cup is, though. And got, got my favorite teacup from Sandy Chan. Stay wild, moon child. That'd be me. Mm. And my tea. I, I, I usually drink about two cups of hot tea, and usually it turns into cold tea by the time I'm done. But, uh, okay, let's see, do, 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 uh, Bonnie Northern, Texas, Jen M, yeah, I am, I'm just tired, guys, uh, so again, I'm not sure how long tonight's gonna last, as for last week, I did contact Cindy Michelle of Diamond Painting Fanatics, and everything is fine with her, and I, and her, and, and everything is fine, she was having technical issues, so I was a little worried about her last week, uh, cause she went poof, and so anyway, I ended up uh, uh, ending early last week. Well, I don't know if y'all call three hours early or not compared to me. Most probably, yeah. Um, but I went and I finally talked to her, and uh, she was fine. 
Yeah, so she was having uh, technical issues, but I was worried about her, so I ended up uh, closing early uh, and, and, and saying goodnight early um, and checking on my girl. Okay, uh, you know what, guys? Uh, let's see. Wait a wait a Oh, I can't find nothing. Where is everything today? Uh, I, I don't know if I'm exhausted or if I'm tired. One or the other. Um, or both. Dad, and I woke up with something in my eye. You know how you get sleep in your eye? Uh, I woke up, but I'm, I'm just falling apart today. Okay, so messenger and, uh, so, do, 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 do. Settings. No, that's not it. Okay. Copy. And, um, so, uh, excuse me one second. Uh, do, 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 do. Ooh, sorry guys, give me one minute. Am I together tonight? No. Am I together any night? <laughs> you kidding me? Um. Okay, so there you go. That is for where make sure I'm in the right place. Okay, and that goes there. Um. That goes there. Usually, I just kind of go down the line here. Uh, tonight, we have no specific special guest. Um, if you would like to come and hang out, you are welcome to. If you do not feel like it, I totally get it. Uh, and... Um, you know, you can and you can't. Uh, it is whatever, you know, you guys feel like doing. Um, so, you know, I mean, oops, need to hit the enter button on that one. So, usually what I do is I just kind of go down the list and everybody invites. If they won't come, they come. If they don't, they don't. Um, you know, one of them kind of things. So, uh, anyway, that's how that goes. Hang on a second. Let me get my thing up here. Who have I missed? Uh, Risa, Jen M. Um, if you're not feeling up to it, you should have canceled live. Are you kidding? I, I will be here with my head in a bucket. I can't guarantee how long I'm going to be live, but doggone it, I'm live. Uh, Joe Atwood, hello, 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 Karen Lewis, hello, hello, flip flop, we would be, we would be cute, um, StreamYard wouldn't let me on, we chatted for a few hours, yeah, um, and, uh, yeah, Diamond Painting Fanatics, I feel disowned, she don't love me this week, nope, she don't love me this week, I feel disowned, oh, uh, She's abused me. She just don't love me no more. I haven't talked to her all week. Yep. She just don't love me no more. But no, I'm just joking. Uh, between her being crazy busy and between me being crazy busy, uh, Cindy Michelle and I just honestly haven't had a chance to catch up with each other this week. I sent her a jokey message. I said, yeah, i am been disowned. You don't love me no more. Kick me to the curb. Treat me like a red-headed stepchild. Um, Linda Bain. Hello, hello, hello. Kevin's wife. Hello, hello, hello. Kevin's wife. Did I send Kevin's wife? Yes, yes. I sent Kevin's wife. Uh, so, and Jen Lane. Big love to Jen Lane. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your YouTube support. 
um jen i i have found a way to uh add my youtube people to my patreon people so now you guys are on the wheel and are available to win prizes um so usually um whatever doggone i gotta i must have hit something i got a breeze right there so anyway um you guys are i finally managed to get all that done i finally got all of uh, google adsense set up and uh so thank you much much love to everybody for your donations each week uh which is the little dollar sign that's listed below i think they call it like super chat uh and then they've got the join um and then i've got patreon personally i prefer patreon because uh it gives me uh people's address and that way i don't have to hunt people down and when it's their birthdays and what have you i can just pop them off something um and let's see mother i don't know if i said hello to you or not hello my mother uh tammy simmons hello hello sweet pea hi darling uh karina hi scott hello in the background um kevin's wife and uh jen m oh nick she loves you because she finds you those hot bad boy diamond paint i know right I, I I she I love them. I, I gotta get started on those, man. I love me some. I I tried to go and surf her site last night, and honestly, I was so doggone tired. I kept falling asleep, and it was like, okay, I gotta come back to it. Uh, cause this has been just no joke, guys. This was uh, a crazy week. Cause when I make my putties, I make my putties in big, huge batches. And normally it's an all day thing because you got to glue the top on it. You got to wait for the top to dry. Then you got to make the putties and then you've got to uh, put the putties in the jar, which you got to do it one at a time. And then you got to put them in the little bag and then you got to put them in another little bag and then you got to put them in the shoe box. And by the time it's all said and done, you end up with you know your finished product but it's a lot of as they say the devil's in the details so um i've been you know i always try to do the extras now guys um some of you that have ordered from me have noticed that uh i'm not wrapping uh trays like i used to i haven't stopped Okay, it however, until I can get caught up on the putties, Mr. Einstein, uh, the hubby. Okay, dude, we're not playing this up and down business. Okay, up or down, up or down. See, up or down, up, down, up, down. There you go. Uh, so anyway, what it is is we've got Ziploc bags and or we have specific size bags and i put my stickers on the bags you know you got to have them stickers on there y'all love my stickers um but i haven't been wrapping um as much okay so i apologize for that to me honestly i really don't like the bags maximilian the, uh, the rocket the, pick a name would you whoever you are i know i don't <laughs> That's so many names. Um, anyway, um, y'all will notice that, you know, you're getting them ugh, in, the zip, in, a, in a Ziploc bags with the stickers on them. So I'm sorry to me, they're kind of tacky, but Mr. Einstein refuses to wrap, okay? He just refuses to wrap. So for right now, uh, I do apologize, but you're still getting the stickers. Trust me, I just spent like $300 and nothing but stickers. So, uh, but again, if y'all get, you know, your orders and they're not wrapped, I'm sorry. I apologize. It's just, there's not enough for me to go around. 
there there just isn't i need a i i need an extra two days in a week and i need an extra six hands i'd pray to be an octopus right this minute because i could really use the extra arms um and let's see um just hung in there and waiting for rocket fuel uh yeah rocket fuel oh thank you uh scott you're so right rocket fuel okay now i'm awake i'm sorry there's nothing to wake you up <clears throat> faster than dr pepper is like hello all right come on it's, you, you know if i said how much i hate phones i think i say this on a daily basis all right there and mute 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 not to mention my fingers i, I swear the phones have gotten smaller again and i got itty bitty fingers okay so it's kind of like you know when my itty bitty fingers and i'm having to do this with the pinky and it's like yeah pain in the butt but uh okay uh she loves you okay and i'm going down the list thank you dreamer y'all don't forget to go check out dreamers craft corner uh linda make sure to post the youtube your youtube link uh love and sparkles make sure to post your youtube link as well Get this, guys. I've been in, I've been in Facebook jail for the past six days because in my own channel now, in my own group, you know how I number I do all the numbers. Well, apparently, in your own group, if you respond to too many things at one time, they think you're spamming, and they put me in Facebook jail. So I had to round up the gang. And uh, it, it was so. If y'all see anybody that helped, you know, like Anita and Love and Sparkles and what have you, that helped them with the numbers this week, that's why. Um, and that way, I don't have to do a whole lot. I think even Mr. Nix got in, Mr. Einstein got in the mix, you know, because um, I, I, you would think it being a group, you should be able to post as much as you want to okay so why the hell you know they they have such a tight restriction on it it, it just aggravates me to death but Kay Connor, take 10 hello 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 my darling um uh there we go and so anyway welcome back to the family carrie uh aka take 10 she has the most fabulous candles in the world however right this minute she has had to uh shut her store down but it will not be for long she said to let everybody know she'll be back again soon uh so you guys hang in there and uh she's got some new goodies coming up some soap and some all kinds of stuff a quick hi before we drive home snow is bad right now carrie you guys be careful ma'am uh tammy simmons hi hi tammy i'm honestly i've lost track on who i've said hello to and who i haven't uh snuggies hi snuggy Snuggy is not going to be with us for much longer, and it is because Snuggy got a fantastic new job. Oh, making Uber bucks too, ma'am. Snuggy sent me a message and goes, guess what, Nicks? I got some good news. I got some good news. I got a really cool job, and... So, the only thing about it is that Snuggy has to work on Saturday night. So, this is most probably going to be her last Saturday night here. You will also notice a star by Snuggy's name. Thank you, thank you, thank you, my darling, for your support. Uh, but Snuggy uh, is going to catch us on replay. And all you do is just go down the comment section, go hashtag replay. And that lets me know you're here. 
Um, again, all of my peeps that are in the YouTube, uh, uh, who joined my YouTube, I have found a way to get you guys into uh, the wheel. So y'all are now eligible to win goodies. Hello. Um, let's see. Did I say going down the list, guys? Uh, uh, okay. I think I got everybody. Aaron Colley. Hello. Just in case. Don't want to make sure I miss anybody. Kevin's wife. Oh, man. Me and Kevin's wife. We got to get together. We got to come up with some good stuff. Rose Willis. Hello. 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 Um, again, uh, guys, if you click the, uh, more button, there'll be a big, huge drop down. Uh, all of my links are there. If you are a Patreon member, your name is there. And we spin the wheel each week for, uh, Patreon for a $25 gift certificate. Uh, we also uh, have everybody that supports in YouTube. Uh, 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 anybody that, and, and Patreon and YouTube and all that good stuff is all listed down below. And I have found a way to get everybody in because this is my way of show, showing appreciation and saying thank you for your love and your support and 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 uh because all the money and all the revenue that comes in goes back into the channel nine times out of ten it goes back into the phoenix fantasy 2024 who kevin's wife and kevin are doing our phoenix fantasy pins this year uh or next year for 2024 uh also kevin and knox uh our beautiful knox are collabing and are creating the artwork for uh phoenix fantasy 2024 uh i am excited to see that i can't wait um so anyway those two uh, yeah those two together man oh my goodness it is it, it is going to be absolutely amazing and i have commissioned them for that so uh when they are done i am going to pay them beautiful people and i will own that uh artwork outright I will have it on t-shirts. I'm making diamond paintings out of it. Coffee mugs. All the kind of good stuff. Same thing pretty much we had last year. Uh, I did work on the Phoenix Fantasy 2024 uh, Amazon link. Which if I'm not mistaken is listed below. And uh, it is for people who would like to sponsor um, the uh, Phoenix Fantasy event, but do not have a store. That was one of the big things. A lot of people come, you know, to me and they go, hey, Nix, I don't own a store, but I want to help sponsor, you know, what have you. Um, so I got this from my grandkids because I don't know about y'all's grandkids, but mine are like, hey, Grams. I got my Amazon wish list for Christmas ready, you know, and I'm like, this was new to me. I, you know, I always thought you just bought your kids, you know, what you wanted them to have. Not no more. Now we got wish list. Okay. So you're, you know, kind of like a wedding registry where you go and you, you pick out, you know, what, what they have in their wish list. So, um, you know, it was like, yeah. Uh, Kevin's wife, don't worry. I'm planning my sleep schedules, so I'm rested when we chat. I tell you what, girl, when I get off of here, it, you know, joke, uh, guys, I am not going to lie in advance. We might be here an hour. We might be here 10 hours. I don't know. Uh, the way I'm feeling right this minute, I'm here, but I can't guarantee how long. Um, but yeah, uh, I agree because me and Kevin's wife, when I talk, y'all know me. I talk. I don't. I I I I talk to the fence post. It is still long enough. But I'm just tired. Uh, but again, 
So before um, I spin the wheel, and again, um, everybody that has uh, participated in either Patreon, who is a Patreon member, or has joined a YouTube group, you must join to be in the drawing, okay? Uh, super chat doesn't count. Uh, uh, thank you, thank you, thank you for the super chat, people. Uh, that is the little dollar sign down five. I, I'm still figuring that out. I got to make some little thingies or something. Uh, Aaron Colley, my four-year-old niece told me yesterday, I only want one gift for Christmas or 100. <laughs> There's no middle ground with that one. Aaron, the last time I talked to Alex, who is my eight-year-old, it started out, Grams, I want a Lego set. Then five, sec five seconds later, he's got ADHD like his Grams. And he goes, Grams, I think I need $100 instead. And he goes, no, wait a minute, Grams, I think I need $500. Well, I don't know. I kind of want this too. So, Grams, I think I'm going to need a thousand dollars. And I, I, I'm like, okay, you have never sent Grams a birthday card or a Christmas card. So, why is Grams supposed to give you a thousand dollars? And he goes, well, I don't know when your birthday is. I said, my birthday's around Mother's Day. I just kind of gave him that, you know, because he's he's eight. And so he goes, okay, well, I'll remember from now on. Well, Grams, I think I only need like the Lego set and $200, you know, and needless to say, <laughs> by the time it was all said and done, he was like, you know, I done, I done talked him out of it because it was like, well, why should I give you that? I, Grams never got a Christmas card, you know. But you know how kids are. You know, I always send my kids money. Yeah, you can't go wrong with money. That's all I got to say. Um, so anyway, um, you know, it was like I, I do. I, I just I, I send each one of my grandkids a hundred bucks, and that saves me a headache. Um, which, by the way, those of you that were not here last week, uh, my son showed up. He did get Christmas morning. He gave everybody the update uh, on Christmas morning. It was at Hobby Lobby. They unframed it. They vacuumed it. Um, got all the shards of glass out of it. Uh, the glass that was in it, we went top of line with museum glass. Um, and so he went to go pick it up today. It is paid for 150, uh, no, I'm sorry, $130 for just the glass. Okay. Uh, so anyway, he did pay for it and it will be, uh, picked up on Monday. They apologized profusely for it not being done. Uh, the guys look at the looked at the frame he said the frame was still really good there was no issues with frame so it's like <laughs> hail mary on that one um but anyway um excuse me my nose just i think it's my makeup my nose just decides it wants to do its own thing anyway um it will be uh home it will finally have made it to my son's house in Texas, which only took two years to get there. But it will finally be there in one piece. And there is only eight drills throughout the entire thing that is missing. And I made it a game for the kids because, you know, I, I didn't know how to trust me i could send the drills to my kid and he'd never figure out how to do it so it was like all right here's the deal y'all find the eight missing drills out of a gazillion drills because christmas morning is huge uh and i said then there you go whoever can find all eight of them will get an extra prize from grams so um anyway 
uh, I, I just, you know, what else are you going to do? I couldn't drive to Texas and fix it. So it was, and it's already sealed because when I had it framed, I also had it sealed. So no air would get in it. And, you know, it, it would literally last forever. Uh, so, and they go huge. Uh, they, they love Christmas. Honey, they don't start at Christmas now. So, you know, it's like, well, we got three days till Halloween. They've already done started Christmas. Um, I know, I know. Uh, I tell you what, I was looking today and I, I don't know who, um, uh, so, uh, sorry, I was reading something real quick. Uh, I, I don't know. I was looking at Diamond Art Club because I'm looking for another style of Christmas morning. Now, you got to remember, Christmas morning was like detailed to the max, okay? It was crystal clear. And, um, you know, there was no, uh, you could tell what everything was. I was looking at it this year. I don't know if Diamond Art Club's got a new, uh, what do they call them people? Um, uh, a, a, a new designer or, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? You know, the ones that convert the picture into the, into the diamond painting. Because everything that I've looked at, especially the Christmas stuff, it's like, it's not clear like it used to be like christmas morning and i was looking at dreamers design and oh my goodness dreamers design so, sometimes you love them sometimes you hate them they're a hit and a miss um but i'm not saying anything bad about either one of the companies but uh hand charter thank you uh cindy love and sparkles y'all make sure to go by her youtube channel and her group and y'all y'all go and and see her um but i was looking for you know something like christmas morning you know just one of them like uber big ones and it'd be really nice uh i i have not seen anything as of yet uh that i liked it it um diamond art club had had a really nice one uh that come out this week and so did dreamers design but when you looked at the rendering of it um it was just like a blob it was like a hot mess and so sorry dreamers design sorry diamond art club i love both of y'all trust me y'all still got my money okay so there you go um but yeah i also got uh uh uh, uh, uh randall spanger's uh castle which uh i figured was gone because i woke up late and it, I, I come flying in here and it was like oh my god it's gonna be gone it's gonna be gone so now uh, i don't know how many how many randall spangler ca uh, castles or you know the big houses there are uh i've got every one of them that's come out so far that diamond art club's done i haven't missed one including this last one so it was still available but uh, over a hundred bucks it was it was still avail available you bought the other two spanglers i'm not a big spangler fan i i i, I do have them uh, I do like Treasure Island. Uh, that one's pretty cute because it's got a lot of color in it. Um, I like Josephine Wall. I, I'm I'm just I like confetti and and stuff because with ADHD I get bored if I have like big swaths of you know like one color. Um, and I know that my Josephine Wall, which by the way I finally finished, yes. Uh, it has got to make its way to Hobby Lobby and get framed, but my kid kind of, kid kind of, you know, got to take care of your kids first. 
Uh, I'm waiting for the captured by radiance that is to die for captured by radiance. Captured by radiance. Uh, you're gonna have to uh, send me love and sparkles. You're gonna have to send me the link to that. Uh, you do not forget to go buy Diamond Painting Fanatics and uh, check out all of her fantastic artists and her diamond paintings. Uh, Diamond Painting Fanatics, um, I have three, possibly four. I'm waiting on my Cheshire. I'm waiting on Alice in Wonderland and my Cheshire cat to come in any day. I was really, really, really hoping that it would have come in, uh, last week, but it didn't. So hopefully it'll come in this week. And uh, once I get it, I'm going to turn around and I got a couple others that I'm going to pick out. So also, too, I wanted to ask a favor from all of you guys that are here tonight, which we got 38 people watching. Please spread the news, okay? Uh, you can now buy, uh, diamond, uh, you can now buy Nix's Notions diamond painting trays and putties from Diamond Painting Fanatics in UK. So anybody that lives outside of the United States, you can now go and, uh, 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 buy uh, diamond painting, uh, Nix's diamond painting trays and what have you um, from Diamond Painting Fanatics. And I, I got a, I glanced. Uh, she has some of my putties and what have you. If you see something that is like on Nix's Notions but not on Diamond Painting Fanatics, just give one of us a yell. Uh, we're flexible. We'll make it happen. And the reason why um, this is a first for me, and I mean first ever, okay? Um, I am, I have got a death grip on my work. I always have, if you don't believe me, you ask Sandy Chan, she'll tell you. Um, I've had a lot, a lot of people come to me and go, hey, Nick, you know, can we collab? Can I put your stuff in my store? And it's like, nope, you know, all my customers uh, regardless of what it was that I was selling, um, it was always, you know, I took pride in my work and, uh, I had control over my work, freaky control, um, that if, you know, my customers purchased an item, then, uh, if it was damaged or if it had a problem or something, then they came to me, Okay. Also, too, I had control over what that item was when it walked out the door, which I'm a perfectionist. And if it's not good enough for me, then it is not going out the door. So, um, you know, B grades, if by some chance you manage to get a B grade, that is because Mr. Einstein's going blind and missed it. Yes, I laid it off on him, and yes, he's sitting three feet away from me. So um, he's going blind, and he missed it. But all you gotta do is message me and go, "Hey, Nix, I I got a I got a, a a B grade tray, and you will have a replacement ASAP on its way, which is rare, which is rare. Um, but now that I'm not rapping." uh you know the trays for right this second um it, you know some of them because he's going blind uh some of them um you know do kind of slip by so you know we're, we're gonna lay it off on him uh, uh so yeah anyway if you live outside and i need y'all's help okay yes i'm coming back around here I need y'all's help. I need y'all to go tell everybody that lives outside the United States that now they can buy Nix's Notions diamond painting trays, 
uh, um, confetti carousels, pretty much anything that's in my store, okay? If y'all wanted, I'm sure me and Cindy Michelle, you know, we're flexible. We'll make it happen, you know, one way or the other. But what she does and how we save on uh, shipping is the fact that um, she sends me bulk orders, okay? And I will fill the bulk orders and send them back to her in one box. And this saves on shipping, okay? So it's it, it really does help a lot. And it doesn't matter if you live in Canada, if you live in Berlin, you live in UK, it doesn't matter where you live. If you live outside the United States and you want a Nixus Notions diamond painting tray, go to Diamond Painting Fanatics. She's got she's got little pictures there that's got Nixus Notions on it. You just click that and everything's there. So uh uh, anyway, uh, if y'all have any questions about that, they'll rock at me. Uh, is there any questions about the, you know, and again, thank you in advance for letting everyone know that lives outside the U.S. that uh, now they are available. Uh, Tammy Simmons, if I did not say hello to you, hello, darling. Um, yeah, that's a good question. I got to go look and see if if, if uh, Cindy Michelle of Diamond Painting Fanatics has any Christmas. I haven't looked. But I'm not a big Christmas person. My kids are, um, matter of fact, Christmas morning, I got halfway through it um, and I sent it to Ralph. Uh, Ralph energy ended up finishing it for me that that diamond painting has been through the ringer now you hear me um it it has made the rounds but i'm i it's not that i hate christmas i don't hate christmas i'm just i used to really christmas is a bad time of the year for me it's a very depressive time of the year so i have to be careful with myself and last uh last november and last december was extremely bad uh for me so i literally y'all want to talk about the old saying paint that clown face on you know uh yeah i i i'm not gonna lie last november and december trust me for that two months i faked it faked it fake it till you make it um, and I did because I, depression hit me so hard. Uh, I was suicidal. I'm not gonna lie. I was suicidal. Um, and, and you guys were a huge help because you guys are kind of like a responsibility, you know, where I have to get out of bed and be here on Saturday nights. And it's kind of like Nix's notions is a responsibility because your orders, you know, I have to get out of the bed. Whereas a lot of people, when they hit depression, it's very hard for them to motivate. Not to mention with my ADHD on top of it, it we hit these, these um, my brain's going a million miles an hour, but my body's not moving, okay? And I call it kind of like the best description that I can give it is like the roulette wheel at a casino, how it goes around, you know, it's got the little red and black and it's got all these numbers and it's got the little white ball, right? Well, that's my brain. But that little sucker is going a million miles a minute. And my brain is that little white ball. And it never stops. Even in my sleep, it never stops. Um, could I go and take the medication for ADHD and what have you? Uh, my doctor flat out refused to give it to me. And it is because uh, I have severe anxiety disorder. Along with 99 yards of other stuff. Uh, but honestly, I, I really don't talk about it too much. Other than, yo dudes, I got ADHD. What else? You know, everybody else has got that. 
Um, but you know, as far as like getting into the details of stuff, I really don't tell a lot of people, you know, my business, uh, because everybody's got something, you know, I mean, who am I? I'm nobody special. I'm nobody different. Everybody's got, you know, the same issues and the same problems I have. So, you know, why should I whine and cry and, you know, what have you, but, um, I know that for me, though, one thing I am going to tell you guys in advance, you know, um, last year was crazy bad. It, it started in July. I felt it coming. Uh, and then by the time November and December got here, uh, no joke, uh, I'm surprised my husband didn't find me in the bottom of this closet over here. Uh, um, let your imagination take it from there. But this year, so far... Um, things have been, you know, fairly, fairly good. Uh, I don't know why. That's, that's the thing right there is I call it a light switch. Um, and because sometimes, you know, uh, and, um, uh, sometimes it's like you up, up, up. And then and it's like somebody flips the light switch and then you're down, down, down. So, um, you know, right now, all of a sudden, no joke, about a week ago, uh, because I looked at my husband and said, I don't want to breathe anymore. Uh, I, I don't want to breathe anymore. I don't know why I'm breathing. Uh, I'm just, I don't, I don't want to breathe anymore. Uh, and I was that way for, uh, I'm going to say almost a year, almost a year. And then I woke up one day, uh, a, a couple of weeks ago and it was like somebody flipped the light switch onto the world and, uh, everything's better. Uh, I'm not, you know, um, I think it's because I'm busy. Believe it or not, Nix's notions really does help a lot. It it, it 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 focuses my brain. So thanks to you guys uh, and your orders and your what have you. Um, so uh, anyway, you know, uh, yeah. So, you know, and that's, all, that's about the gist of what I'm going to say on that. This year so far, knock on wood, um, I'm doing good. And, and you know, uh, usually like a, like a light switch, you know, November, uh, midnight, December, th uh, I mean, uh, October 31st, uh, or should I say November 1st, uh, at 12.01, it's light switch. And I will go from happy, happy, happy because I love Halloween and I love the kids and I love dressing up and we decorate and, you know, we do all this. Um, and then as soon as Halloween's over, uh, it, you know, he starts packing up the yard and and honestly, you know, everything is put away uh, by, the, you know, by that evening. And uh, it's just like, you know, the fun or what have you is over. My kids, everybody lives in Texas. So there's nobody here but me and him. And, you know, why go and decorate and do all that that stuff, you know. Um, uh, and I, honestly, <laughs> I have no place to put a Christmas tree unless I stick it on a roof. No joke. I, I literally, I've got 3D printers everywhere. I have no room for nada. Um, but anyway, so things are good this year. You know, I don't know why, uh, they just decided the light switch decided to do its thing. Uh, with depression peaking during the holidays, it is related to longer darkness, lost friends, uh, and family uh, and isolations come from MH nurse that takes care of veterans. Yes, Chris, you are 100% correct. Um, it is called SAD, uh, seasonal, oh God, uh, seasonal, uh, something disorder. Uh, had that since I was a kid. Uh, and, you know, but again, Mr. Einstein, 
we have specific lights in the house that he put in the house that are white lights, you know, kind of like sunshine. Um, and they are everywhere. So usually when time changes and it gets really dark, you know, early and what have you, um, we have specific lights, uh, that helps with that. Uh, so we've done everything except for the medication and, you know, doc is like, no, we're not going to do that. Cause apparently ADHD medication is speed of some kind. And he says, you are hyper enough and don't need any more. And no, we're not going to do that. So, um, yeah. So, anyhow, uh, you know, my my brain is, uh, I told y'all I'm crazy. Yeah, I, 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 I'm crazy with a capital C. Um, so, and Diana Degnap is in the house. Hello, hello, hello. Um, yeah, daylight bulbs. Uh, welcome back, Sandy. Uh, I walk. I was walking to the car. Ah, uh, still here, just on the phone. All right. This is what we got for this week. I'm going to start out with um, the putties. This is the one of, now these come in, oh gosh, um, everything is a different color, okay? Each eye is a different color. So please don't go, hey, Nicks, I want yellow or I want red or I want green or I want whatever because they're already bagged up. They're already done and I can't see what color is what. Uh, the putty color is, y'all can't see that because it is green. Let me switch here. There we go. Um. Where's my camera? There's my camera. Okay, there we go. Uh, the putty color is a turquoise. I tried to find like a dragon color green. But anyway, all of them are dragon's eye. And it goes with the Motley Dragon. And the name of this is Motley Dragon Eye. Okay. Um... And it comes in, there is 50 different colors. So there you go. You get to collect them. And the smell, yep, smells really good too. So, uh, and on the listings, I always put what the company gives me as far as what the smell is made of. Okay, so always, if you ever want to know what a putty smells like, look in a description because that description comes directly from the company and what it smells like. So that is Motley Dragon Eye. Okay, now we have Pumpkin Pie. And I do have new pumpkins coming and they are one inch so they're going to be bigger. Uh, however, already made it. And there is your pumpkin pie. Come on, focus in here, dude. There we go. Come on, focus. You did just a second ago. There we go. All right. And that's got the double ends in it. And oh my gosh. Now to me... It, it's, I smell cinnamon, okay, but it also smells like cake, so anyway, or pie, uh, but this here is pumpkin pie, and these are five ounces, okay, uh, the jars are medical grade glass jars with, um, <coughs> airtight lids, um, and then here is pumpkin patch and this is, um, the, um, I try, I just, I ran out of mica powder. So I finally got some, my new mica powder in today. Come on, dude. Focus. 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 Wow. It's got the double ends on it. So anyway, 
um and this is called pumpkin patch and uh it smells really good too but again that one smells like brandy and cookies to me anyway um i go nose blonde i i deal with these so much i go nose blonde uh then we have candy corn uh and it is candy corn putty and it is yellow and orange i and if you look on the side you can see where the yellow and the orange is uh i finished this at three o'clock in the morning before i went to bed um and so you get the cute little candy corn on top uh candy corn on the bottom and it will all come in the little organza bags and you get goodies and what have you so last but not least is lilacs and lilies carrie asked for this now uh as far as lilacs and lily goes these flowers are different colors okay i've got red pink blue purple yellow and red pink blue purple yellow and i think there's another color anyway uh the color you get is going to be the color you get okay guys but it smells really really good oh my gosh if you like lilacs and lilies oh my gosh this is the one for you and it smells so good i have to admit i really like that one uh but carrie wanted this so i threw this together really quick uh right this minute we have coming we have enchanted we have snickerdoodle we got candy cane lane we have berry frost uh we have uh coffee we have cafe vienna we have peppermint twist we have spice cider we have what are you you i can't see the name we have um it is uh i want to say it's oatmeal cookies uh i got gingerbread holidays which is from last year and bring them back uh and i got mrs butters uh i love that name i thought it was cute uh and because it's got the little uh uh, uh thing on top of it and then we got santa's reindeer treats okay yes i brought that back from last year um and let's see oh i got a new sea turtle it's gonna be unscented and this is for people that have um uh sensitive to smells and what have you so the sea turtle is a gorgeous sea turtle and uh really pretty and it's vibrant colors and what have you but uh i'm gonna put some uh white glitter in it so it's pretty much going to be white with with some glitter and some rainbowy sparkly stuff um and then let's see we got i got apple i got three kinds of apples coming i got apple pie i have candy apple and i have green apple um and then i got uh sweet candy confections bahama berry uh what's the other one i haven't figured out what to do with them frogs yet uh i have cloud dancer that goes with the uh with the trays i got wisteria lane oh my god that one smells so good uh and then i got sugar lips which uh it, it might end up being hot lips remember hot lips hula hand you know from mash so okay these are three out of the four new colors uh this is a color changing wait a minute i can't i can't see y'all so hang on a second 
Uh, do -do 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 -do. Okay, any questions? The rocks, if you got any questions. Mr. Einstein ain't said anything, so I guess I didn't have any. All right, this is a color changing, okay? And it it's blue, okay? And it is... Let's see where... There we go. And see, it changes to pink. It changes to a um, a fluorescent neon pink. So kind of reverse from the other. Uh, and as you can see on both sides. Now, anything that you hold in your hand. My hands are kind of cold, so it's cold here. Um it changes colors from 88 degrees or hotter, okay? Uh, hi, Chris uh, Brummond. I'm not sure if I said hello earlier or not. Hi, Chris. Um, and I miss anybody. Linda Wigren. <laughs> hello, darling. Uh, Diana Decknap, and I think that's everybody. Mother, Sandy, Karen Lewis. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, just making sure I didn't miss anybody. Okay, and look at there. Now that, this part right here is just me with my hands, holding it with my hands. This was a lighter. Okay, so you're going to get a different color. But uh, anyway, this is going to be going up. Now, this... I have had this before. It never sold. Uh, and I ended up discontinuing it. But as y'all know, uh, my goal is to have 100 colors uh, in what I call the herd. Uh, which is available for you guys that are not specialty colors. Okay. Uh, this here is a UV um or a black light um in so many words the less you set the sucker underneath there uh, nobody's got regular light bulbs anymore so it don't work uh you could set this on um your light pad and try it i have not tried that yet hi amber i see you I'm lurking and eating dinner. Mm, what you eating? Uh, so anyway, this here, if you take it outside and you put it in the sun or if you're working under a lamp. Uh, where is my? Okay. One, two. Now, this is a specific neon. Okay. See, see how it's purple? Okay. This is a neon light. UV light. Uh, I'm sorry, UV light. I was corrected. It is a UV light. See it? See how it, it makes it the yellow glow on the paper? Okay. Anyway, wow, look, it's already done changed the colors. Can y'all see that? And that was just me flickering it around. So this is a fast changing, but watch this. Check it out. That I thought was cool as hell. Um, anyway, this is UV. And if you take it and set it in the sun or if you have some type of light or what have you, uh, it will change from white uh, to the purple. It is a, a pinky purple. White. But, huh? You can use black light. Uh, Mr. Einstein said you could use black light as well. Oops. There we go. And again, I mean, it don't take much. And the more, uh, it, you know, that it, you can see the difference on how long I let it sit in a, in a spot, you know, if I hurry, hurry, hurry. Um, but yeah. 
and it lasts pretty good a while because there's the two and i mean i just literally flashed the light over those and they instantly turned i want to try this and see how it works you know but there you go guys it's something new to play with it's something different um so that is okay that is uv that goes in there so i don't forget to post that and then this here is the brand new teal color uh it's called azure azure if i'm pronouncing this correctly uh brand new just come in uh this is teal teal this is real teal I hate that teal that I have. That is not teal to me. That's, that's a doggone pine tree green or something like that. But anyway, I finally found this one. So this is another color. So by the time I'm done adding these to the herd of 62, that's going to give us 65, 66 colors thereabout. And I'm not going to stop. No joke um i'm not gonna stop until i have um over 100 colors and the reason why and i i hope the world's listening and if they don't like it they can scratch their mad spot and get over it and if they don't get if they don't understand it well i don't know what else to say but here's the thing okay i hate drops now i understand that some people have to do them because of their jobs or the kids or the way they work. So that is totally understandable, okay? But me personally, when everybody was doing all these drops in the beginning, I don't care if it's a diamond painting pen. I, I, I don't care if it's a million dollars, okay? No joke. I, I, I don't do drops. I, I'm not going to go through the anxiety and the fight and, and you know, all of this um, trying to, you know, get what I want. I'm just not going to do it. So this is the 100% un- Un, you know, unequ I, I mean, what's the word? Unequated. Um, this is 100% true, okay, of why I carry as many colors as I do because you guys will never, ever, ever have to fight over a color, okay? It will be in stock 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and or if not, and it will be due to manufacturer issue. That is the only reason why it will not be in stock is if I literally, if the manufacturer runs out, well, I'm SOL. If they ain't got it, I, I darn sure can't get it. Which is what happened to the, uh, the color. Okay. So anyway, like with these here, okay, those are, um, you know, again, I buy them, you know, like Unicorn Party, okay, right this minute, I've got at least six boxes of Unicorn, uh, no, Unicorn Party, I bought a, a case of. Uh, Motley uh, Dragon is my end-all, be-all favorite. Other than, I do got a couple of other favors. Uh, I do like the Raven because every time you look at the Raven, it changes colors. It it, it just, it's wicked. That is a wicked filament. Um, and then the Nebulous. I love the Nebulous, the colors of the Nebulous. So um, anyway, that is that. Now, I'm not done. I got one more new color to show you guys. Um, but I managed to get it uh, printed in the full set. Now, this is uh, Wisteria Lane. It is a silk. Okay. Um, now, Wisteria Lane, as you guys know, is a... Uh, it's a silk and it shifts. See, that's a yellow green and it shifts to purple. And then there's blue. Okay. 
and then that's a multicolor here and then as it goes around it shifts colors so um this was a request um you know so i'm gonna offer it and you can see here you can see the you can see the green okay and then here's the blue this is a combo of the colors um let's see what the box looks like and pretty much the same you don't get a whole lot of um you don't get a whole lot of of color change on this now this is a b grade and will not be sold uh and or will go in the um in the box that i have um that i usually post up about twice a year and it's just a box that i have that when i run up on trays that don't they're still usable but they're not my ocd perfection uh, I'll toss them in a box and if you look right here, you can see where this did not print good It also is not completely round because it raised on the printer So this is considered a B grade uh, Believe it or not, you can see all your colors right there because you got the purple you got the yellow you got the blue uh, and you got the green right there in the date. Uh, it does not show well on the uh, uh, on the camera. I'm sorry, guys. I, I don't know why. It this is more of a green. It has like a yellowy green color to it. But anyway, um, this is. I gotta take some pictures. Uh, I am totally 1000% behind on my pictures but it's like I, I I look at it like this okay if I make something and take pictures make something take pictures why not just make it all at one time and take all the pictures at one time and list everything at one time you know it, it seems to do better so uh, anyway this is called Wisteria Lane this color here um uh, go look at the pictures uh the set is available uh i'm trying to make full sets of everything uh the motley dragon is the only one right this minute that literally has everything yay sandy's home now yay glad you made it home safe um Anyway, the Motley Dragon is the the only set that has every single thing that I print, okay? And I absolutely love that Motley Dragon. Uh, not to mention has the matching dragon eyeball putty to go with it. So, I'm going to set that to the side. And here is the da 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 this is called, let's see if y'all can see that here. This is called the Black Crow. Okay. Now, on the bottom, it's got Nixus Notions 2023. This is the six placer pen stand. I'm using this mostly as an example due to the fact where you can see the color bleed. It is a black to blue to purple okay and as and this is the same thing here now this is purple this is black and it's a glitter it's got mica powder in it so you've got flakes of silver in this now on the camera okay it looks like this is a bright blue but it's not. It really isn't. I don't know why the camera's showing it as a bright blue. But um, this here is black. And it changes to kind of like a purpley blue. Um, I'm, I don't know why the camera. But anyway, 
uh, as you can see, these here are black. Okay. Now, some people like the dark colors. I sell a lot of the Vampire's Desire, which is red and black. Okay. Um, I do have one more of the blacks that I have not done yet. It's a black and a turquoise blue. Uh, and it's called Dark Sky. But I haven't done it yet. As you can see, this is black on the bottom. And you can see where it changes to now that's that blue uh and goes from black now why these are blue i don't know but these trays them those trays right there are purple the and now it's a dark purple okay and i wish this camera would show it better but it is it's a dark purple and then see, you can see the color shift right there, okay, where it changes to the blue. So it's a pretty wicked color. I like it. Um, and I do have, uh, I, I wanted to show you those two right there because it kind of showed the color the best. Uh, it's called Black Crow. I do have the entire set. And as you can see, I got a post a note that I need to take photos. Um, here's the Venti. Okay, the Venti, you see, is black. And then it changes. You can see the color change here. Uh, and then the same here. And, um, you know, I see a little bit of purple to it. Um but again, see, it's like, this looks purple to me, okay? This right here is, looks like a dark, dark purple. Um, and then, now, the Piro, that's a black. Some people like the dark trays. Uh, being totally 100% honest with you, um, if you're using like three tens or some kind of dark, one thing about it is you're going to have a hard time, um, you know, seeing your drills with a dark tray. But again, and then this here is the blue. Um, so there you go, guys. All of the colors are there. Um, including the confetti carousel the stackable and um there's the four inch cover monitor bar uh and it's called the black crow so uh there you go that's gonna be the new colors that i have got to take photos of and um and get listed this is a 11 piece set. You will be able um, to either buy them individually, okay, or you can buy them as a full complete set. Now, here's the thing if you buy um, a full complete set, you are getting it at a 10% discount. Now, look at Look at, look at the code that's running across the bottom. All right. I've already marked it 10% off. Okay. So if you use the next 10 on top of it, then you're going to get an extra 10%. So in all honesty, you're getting 20% off. And that's for the full complete set. So can't beat the prices on that, guys. I don't I don't know what else to tell you. You know, I mean, I, I made it as user friendly and as wallet friendly as I possibly could because in all honesty, my wallet is just like yours, okay? Uh but I gotta admit this is a cool color. I got one more color that's dark like this. Uh it's called dark sky that I've been kind of saving. Uh, but right this minute, I still got 10 colors left that, uh, I have to turn into sets. So, but there you go. That is what I have for right this minute. 
Uh, again, Nix's Notions 2023. Uh, trademark, copyrighted. Um, and there you go. So I figured y'all would like the, 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 the white tray that changes color, you know, with the light or whatever. I have none of those kids will have fun playing with it. Okay. Did I miss anything? If you guys ever have any questions for me, you know, throw a rock at me. Um, and let's see. So, uh, uh let's see. I'm on my way home. Uh, cool. I'm reading up, uh, one random minute. Hello. Just wanted to stop by and say hello. 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 One random minute. Thank you. It's good to see you again. Diamonds and Dew, AKA Lee K. I uh, tried to sneak in quietly and stumbled over the chair. I like Dick Van Dyke. I love it. I love it. Uh, Brandy Stevens. Hello. Hello. Um, and, uh, Linda from Dreamers Craft Corner, please make sure to put in your link and Debbie Gusman, uh, Go Gusman. Uh, thank you. Thank you. I'm glad that you, it does. It reminds me of, uh, the birds and that's why it has the color, uh, the name that it has. So I have, um, three new colors that will be going on, um, the website. Okay. As, um, that will be going on the website uh, as, you know, the regular colors that you guys can buy from. Uh, there we go. Here I is. And go there and go there. Uh, so anyway, um, so do 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 do. Okay. And double checking. I don't know why sometimes it does that and sometimes it don't. But, um... Okay, and like I said, tonight we do not um, have any particular Phoenix Fantasy Group. There we go. Um, we don't have any particular guests. So, uh, Snuggies Crafting Corner. Um... I'm still here taking care of a few things. We're happy to have our Snuggie with us this evening. She ain't going to be with us for much longer. She got a fabulous congratulations to Snuggie. She got a fabulous new job. Uh, and she is going to be... Um, okay, did somebody just delete my damn... Let me see if I can do this again. Thank you very kindly. I don't know who deleted my damn message, but I own a joint. So stop deleting my messages. Uh, so anyway. Uh, so uh, anyway. Uh, what I was going to say is that uh, Love and Sparkles, make sure you put your link out there again. Why? Okay, who in the hell is... Okay, I am posting a link to the chat room in the Phoenix Fantasy group. Okay? I've posted it twice. Who keeps deleting it? Can somebody explain that to me? 
Why is it being deleted out of my Phoenix Fantasy chat group? Everybody should be able to share links in the Phoenix Fantasy chat group. So I don't understand why it is either somebody's doing it or I don't have something set right. So y'all teach me something. This is the third time. Don't delete my... I'm, I'm watching it. I'm watching it. I'm watching it. You should... Well... I'm going to say a bad word here in a minute. Media files and links. Media. Okay. Files. Links. No new pins tonight. Okay. Event sponsors. Nix's notions. Why is it keep getting deleted? I don't understand. I, well, this is in the chat. This is in the Phoenix Fantasy group chat. Right. I put it in my chat. Okay. But I'm trying to put it in the Phoenix Fantasy group chat. Let's see. Um... So, I'm not quite sure what's going on here. Links. It's got links in here. So, why can't I? All right, you being a pain in the butt and I own a joint. Uh, that, that side chat stuff kills me. I end up in side chats and don't even know how. Facebook deleted one of my mods. Okay. Okay, Jennifer. Okay, that's the link to Saturday Night Live. Thank you, Jennifer. Let's see if that stays. Yeah. Now, what I'm doing is I am offering uh, the link for the live chat. You know, somebody wanted to come to the live chat. Okay, posted by Nick Dark Sky. Let's try that. Maybe if they figure out I'm the one that's posting it, then they won't. Deleted. Okay, let's try this again. Jennifer's is staying, so that's cool. So what's the difference between Jennifer and mine? Unless uh, somebody's deleting it. All right. Anyway, we got to spin the wheel, too. Uh, okay, reading up, reading up. Well, I'll be jiggered. It just did again. Okay. Now see. Jennifer just posted it. Alright. So let's see if it stays for Jennifer. Thank you Jennifer. Let's see if it stays for her. Now, I had words ahead of mine. Okay. Nope. It's gone. It deleted it. So, apparently, either somebody's deleting it, but I don't see anybody's name by it. So, if somebody was deleting it, it would say so-and-so deleted it. So, I think that it does not... It does not like the end fight. 
Uh, now, Jennifer, you doing fine. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't know why, but apparently it don't like StreamYard's links. Okay, I, I, I'm not sure what's going on. All right, uh, next, I see the link in the mod group. Yep, I'm trying to get it in the chat, but maybe chat set up uh, uh, because it keeps deleting Jennifer's as well. So, I don't know. Oh, well, Jennifer, we tried. Yep, gone again. Uh, so, anyway, okay, Snuggy, Facebook deleted one of my... Man, I'm in Facebook jail until, like, 2 o'clock. I still don't know why. Um, link permissions were not changed, were they? No, Drew, uh, Diamonds and Drew, help me. Uh, link permissions okay now this is the phoenix fantasy group chat okay so if i missed something or if there is something in there i need to change uh that would be great your 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 help would be greatly appreciated Brandy, don't need to go to Facebook jail. I uh, see now uh, getting the notifications, but only see the Jennifer post. Uh, again, Lee is easier. Uh, Lee, who's Lee? I know three people who have been in Facebook jail. I I know. Look, I you know I I have been on this joint since the day this sucker was invented, and I've never been in Facebook jail in my life. Um, and I was uh modding for T Mall. You know, sharing links. You know, like uh Anita does here. And uh, I ended up in Facebook jail because I shared too many links at one time, and according to them. Now, the second time, the only thing I can think of um, is that, um, that I made too many posts in uh, the chat at one time. So, uh, and, or, or that's what they said, but they, they did, they stuck my little butt in Facebook jail for seven days. So what I did is there's more than one way to skin a cat. I just rounded up all my mods and it's like, okay, peeps, you know, uh, we're going to have to tag team this because usually I just give everybody numbers, you know, and it's like, you can only do like five or 10 numbers at a time, you know? And I figured if we all kind of ganged up on it, then nobody ended up in Facebook jail if we, you know, did, uh, you know, so many per per person. Uh, and yes, I see. I am Lee. Hi, Lee. Um, so, okay. All right. Let's go ahead and share the screen and um, get our... Um, get our wheels going here. Ah, hi, Linda. You know what? I just popped on to tell you. I tried um on my regular Facebook. I put your link for StreamYard, you know, to come in. It posted it right in there. That's how I entered. However, when I tried putting it in the Facebook group, it was saying it was submitted for approval. That would be a thing. Where, where so I think I... it could be if you're still in um, jail. Possible. Okay, where would I go for approval? I don't know. I don't know if it's... If it, somebody said your group, the comments have to be approved. Or if it's by Facebook itself. Well, I'm in the chat. I'm in the Let me try group. something. Let me try something. I'm, I'm leaving the live for a minute on my computer. 
I'm going to go to the Facebook. I don't see anything where it says it had. It's gone now. It, it deleted. Okay. Hold up a minute. I'm going to. Okay. I'm on Facebook. Let me go to the group. Yeah, because see, that's the difference. I'm not in um, Phoenix Fantasy group. I'm in the Phoenix Fantasy. Uh, well, group. I'm just going to say, I'm going to just um, post something regular. Is I just want to see something. Hold on. Post the link to your search to groups your YouTube channel. Phoenix Fantasy. Visit. Okay. I'm just going to write hi. Hi, we testing out some stuff here, people. We're fixing to do giveaways next. Scott, I'm Scott here. Me, I'm Scott here. Oh, okay. Somebody's right. No, girl, I know what's going on. What? It's not being deleted because I went to write. I just put hello, right? And it says your post is awaiting administration approval. If the administration approval team approves it, it will become visible in the group. Somebody, either your moderizer or somebody, went into your settings and said it's that posts have to be approved before they are put on the Facebook group. So what you do to that. All right, give me a minute. Uh, Let me go to my own Facebook group. I'm not in the group. I'm in chat. No, I, I want to see something. I want to tell you how to, to fix that. Groups. I want my group, which I got to do something about that group. I've been ignoring it. Uh, no, this was a chat. That was... Uh, no, no, no. And... Just hold on, girl. I want to go in my Facebook group. I'm going to go to my settings. and my chat so I can tell you. You go to your settings, right? I got and the, you, it. When you go right in the Facebook here. group, your Facebook group, since it's yours, and you, you go to its settings, okay. and it'll tell you whether it has to be submitted or not. Somebody went in there it. and said be submitted and you will see it in there and you just press approve. I just found it and I just approved it. Um, found it? It was in the group though. It wasn't in the chat part of it. So there you go. Okay. okay. Well, I'm, I'm out of here. I just didn't know how to yeah. quickest way to get hold of you. Thank you. Love Bye -bye. you. Bye. Uh, okay. So anyway, guys, there we go. Um, and so for those of y'all that have uh, groups, okay, and you're doing a chat thing, uh, if you're like me, still kind of weeding through this and figuring it out, um, the uh, chat... Um, close that, reload that, uh, all of the, you had to approve them, so, uh, and I guess you got a certain time to approve it, I don't know, um, huh, so, anyway, there is the okay Saturday Night Live. Now I approved them suckers, so they should be here somewhere, unless I approve them in the Phoenix Fantasy. Uh, okay, that was Jennifer. Okay, again, there's Linda. It went into the group. Uh, it went into the group. Uh, okay, let's see. 
and huh okay all this is new so y'all gotta forgive me now i see i'm in the chat room though Oh, Facebook, you're a pain in the butt. Okay, try this one more time. All right, go there. Go over here. Reload. Do I got a pending? I got no pendings. Why do I got no pendings? Because I'm in chat. Literally. I don't know. Okay. I am tired of messing with this. You know what? I will work on this another day at another time. Hello, my darling. How you be? How you be? <laughs> this is Mrs. Kevin from Kevin's Creations. Hey, do you know how this chat group junk works? Nope. I, I am not your tech person. <laughs> That's the wrong person, huh? Let's see. Who have I got? Well, I see Cindy, let your witch got us free. She's got her chat going, or either she forgot to turn it off. Tig's diamond paintings got one going, or they forgot to turn it off. And Firefly's got one going, and then I got mine. But I don't never turn mine off either. Uh, the only thing is I was trying to post the... Uh, you know, the link that I sent you to invite for the live chat. Mm -hmm. Well, when I post it in, in the chat, it freaking deletes itself. It won't stay. So I'm not sure why. So somebody that is smarter than I am is going to have to explain this to me. Which is a lot of people. So anyway, my darling, how is your day other than crazy, busy, busy, busy? <sighs> yeah, not as productive as I would have liked, but. Uh... Well, I know the feeling. Okay. And you know something? We have to sleep sometime. Okay. And right now I am. And I just woke up. I woke up at 530. Uh, I went to bed at 3.40 something this morning and I woke up at 5.30 p.m. this evening. And I swear I feel like I just didn't get enough sleep. I'm tired. Um, <laughs> so I know the feeling. And you've been crazy busy. How was your day today? How how did your thing go? Uh, okay. <laughs> I just didn't get, I had a, I have a really, really super long list of stuff to do and I just didn't get any of it done. So. I thought she was going to some craft thing today. No, no, we're getting ready for a craft show. Oh, my bad. Okay. Yeah. I knew there was a craft something in there somewhere. Yeah. So um, it's, it's a lot of work right now and I just didn't get nearly enough stuff done. Bobby, you know, sometimes we just, look, I'm still sitting here looking at 50 putties, okay? So, you know, you can only do, <laughs> only do so much at one time. I need six extra arms and, you know, um, I need an extra two days in a week and, and I, might, I might have it. And hello to Kevin, wherever Kevin's at. He's most probably downstairs working his wonderful self. He is not. Oh, he, he went to bed? He, uh, not yet. He didn't fall asleep playing his game just yet. <laughs> oh, instead of oh, working. He, he, he said, said it's coming. <laughs> Kevin, I want to see your, I want to see your butt. You got, you uh, I think she would like to see your by. face. <laughs> I see that butt. You barely do a drop by. 
Now, and, and I'm babe. from the South, okay? So when we say we want to see yeah. your butt, that is literally not meaning I want to see your I, ass. <laughs> that means, you know. Oh, I know. Yeah, he uh, he made a um, large, expensive purchase this morning and then spent the afternoon um, turning his arms to jelly with that new expensive purchase. So he's, he's we, a little bit tired. Are we allowed to say what it was? It's a chainsaw. Oh, my God. Well, honestly, I have to admit, it might have been a large, expensive purchase, but I'm pretty sure it was well needed. It <laughs> Yes. I, <laughs> I told him, I'm like, yay, no more yelling in the basement. <laughs> well, I mean, y'all do so much woodwork, okay, and stuff yeah. that, you know, um, and I mean, I've seen the logs. That you, I mean, some of them are like five foot high, you know, and bigger. So almost. And that's what he was cutting today. So that's. So, I mean, yeah. you know, uh, I, I'm sure the chainsaws were were way better than, you know, slinging an axe at it. But I don't know. I watch this little dude on on uh, Facebook Reels and. You know, he looks like a fireman. He's built like a fireman, but he swings an axe. And the axe head of the axe is like this big, humongous axe. And he can split one of them things with like two hits. And it just literally splits. Yeah, but bless his little heart. Yeah. I don't know if I can see Kevin. <laughs> I think the head of the axe might weigh more than Kevin does. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my goodness. All right, baby girl. I need you to hold on for me and let me get these uh, wheels done really quick uh, before people start yelling at me. And, um, okay, guys, what I have done is um, the people that uh, like Snuggie's Craft Corner, if y'all will look beside Snuggie's name, y'all will see a star, okay? Snuggie has joined my YouTube channel, okay? And is a monthly supporter of my YouTube channel. So I was trying to find a way uh, to get them uh into the free goodies that i give away so what i've done is i've taken youtube and combined them with patreon okay and y'all will see it's got a a, a a a yt in parentheses beside their name um and that way, if they win something, you know, because I felt bad because, you know, they're donating as well. But they they were kind of like the redheaded stepchildren and getting left out. Uh, and thank you, thank you, thank you. And much, much, much love and many blessings to all of the people that clicked the little dollar sign under the chat. I think that is called super chat, if I'm correct. Uh, somebody correct me on that if I'm wrong. Uh, that is a one-time uh, donation. And uh, so thank you, thank you, thank you. Please know that all funds and everything goes back into the channel. And it goes for Phoenix Fantasy 2024. And I'm saving every nickel and dime and what have you. Uh, if you would like to become a Patreon member, uh, click the more button. The link is below. If you would like to become a YouTube, uh, subscriber, that is somewhere on this page. Thank you for the hearts. I love watching the little hearts float up the page. You know, that is just so cool. Uh, so, okay. Let me share my, that's not it. Uh, share screen. Okay, and we are going to share screens and right this minute, if my mods will confirm, we have 34, uh, wrong one. We have 34 people and Melissa Landa, Landis, Landis is number 34. Uh, 
so and hey you guys even made it to 7 13 see i'm supposed to close it at seven but i was uh i was late and everybody got a number um so anyway uh all comments all comments and so uh everybody got a number and see there's the numbers i don't know why it's not showing the numbers normally it does Any five comments, comments, all, yeah, all comments. So they all should be there. Anyway, all right, let's get over to our, and there are 34. That is confirmed right there. Let's get over to our wheel. As you can see, we are got 34 right there. All the way up from 1 to 34, we're going to shuffle, 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 and shuffle again. This is for the Phoenix Fantasy uh, Whip. And if you are a member of the Phoenix Fantasy Group, you must be a member to win. Okay? If you have not joined Phoenix Fantasy and you win, you are disqualified. You must be a member of Phoenix Fantasy to win, which I just found out that you can post. And because it is a, a public group, and I realized that you could post and not join, uh so you have to join and be a member uh to win uh oban rocks sorry i've been listening and mowing a lawn <laughs> oh wow thank you thank you hey at least he's listening while he's cutting the grass uh thank you obion it's good to see you again uh okay guys i have shuffled let me shuffle a couple more times one two three and good luck everybody phoenix fantasy will we're 10 short this week i wonder where everybody was at and our winner is number five um print screen on that give me that i'm gonna take that and i'm gonna put that over there edit paste is new then i'm going to crop that <laughs> there we go uh and we are going to come over here um and we are going to look and see who hey, our Tammy. number <laughs> Number five is five is Tammy Simmons. Hi, Tammy's here tonight. Yay, Tammy! Congratulations, Tammy. Okay, Tammy, I need you to send me a message uh, through Facebook Messenger, please. Um, and I need you to give me your email. You are the winner of a $25 gift card to Day's Dream. And unless you message me within seven days and give me your email, that means that you will forfeit. Uh, so let me go over here and let me put your name in there so I will know who you are. There we go. And control B and y'all give me a second. You know that I always keep, um, all of my information that way if somebody comes to me a year from now and goes yo next you cheated i can sit there and say hey chew on this so y'all know me uh so it is always cya with me and if y'all don't know what that means that means cover your fanny but the other part 
all right and we got that and okay our next that one is done and please tell me y'all did see that correct did y'all see that the wheel yeah mm -hmm. oh good because <laughs> i lost it uh so anyway I, I it went away. I don't know where it went, but it went away, and it was like, holy crap, did I screw up again? Uh, nope, it's right there. <coughs> I don't know what it's doing. It is just a night, okay? And again, congratulations uh, to our fantastic winner. Uh, we are going to save that and save. And we are going to open up our Patreon, uh, YouTube. I need to edit this. Patreon slash YouTube. There we go. Because we don't want nobody to feel left out. Uh, my YouTube subscribers, if you will notice that uh, you are here Uh and uh amber vaughn you might want to check that baby if you're here tonight because i believe that you are subscribed in both uh and again if you see the yt that is youtube subscribers if you do not see the yt and like megan crunkshack that is uh she is a patreon member Again, if you would like to become a Patreon or a YouTube, click the more button. It's all down there. Everybody that is a member, your name is listed below in the show more section. If you do not see your name, please yell at me. Send me a message. I will make sure to correct that and get that, um, get that uh, fixed in there. So, as you can see, we've got everybody from Amber and our YouTube people. And we've got Kevin and uh, make sure we got all ever. Yep. And uh, all of our people are there. Uh, the only thing that I've got a question about is Amber Vaughn, if I'm not mistaken, Amber. Honey, you are a Patreon member as well as a YouTube member. So, what do y'all think? Y'all think that I should put Amber in there twice since Amber's like a member of both? I wonder how that works. I'm interested in what y'all's opinion would be. So, uh, anyway, this is for a $25 gift card uh, from Amazon. From me until I can find out something else. I figure who doesn't like Amazon? Everybody can buy something from Amazon, even if you live in Timbuktu, Lake Deborah, Debbie, Deb, De, uh, 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 Diana Decknap, who lives in Belgium. They've even got Amazon in Belgium and Kenda as well. So, Anyway, Kevin's wife, I refreshed. I'll see if that helps. Uh, yes, ma'am. And um, again, congratulations to Tammy on her weekly whip. I tried to remind you guys, uh, but again, being in Facebook jail, I could only do so much. But uh, anyway, we were like 10 short this week. So I don't know if people were... I don't know if something going on with school or if people were just out or what. So anyway, all right, here is everybody's name. If you do not see your name and you are a participating member, please give me a yell and let me know. Yes, my husband. Love you. Love you too. Um, and there's a list there. Are you? I already got it. Okay. Um, hey, was there a powder there? Uh, 
little round thing, yeah. Uh, like face powder? Uh, tall, slender cylinder. Nope. Hold on for me one second, guys. I did not come prepared with a song and dance for you guys. Sorry. <laughs> Should have been more prepared to entertain. Okay, I'm back. Believe it or not, my husband is so fantastic. He is one of these husbands that I can literally give him my makeup and send him to Walmart or Clinique or wherever and say, hey, go get this. And he will literally come back with with the correct makeup. So how many of y'all's husbands can do that? So, you know, a lot of husbands is like, I don't even know where the makeup department's at. <laughs> let's, let's buy in the right kind. All right, guys, let's shuffle, 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 shuffle. This is for Patreon and YouTube winners. This is for a $25 gift card to Amazon. Good luck, everybody. Shuffle, 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 and spin. And congratulations, Tina Lewis. Okay. Uh, let me put this where it is supposed to go. Edit, paste, um, and crop. Okay. Got that. Now, uh... Okay. And who is it? Uh, uh, where did I just see them in both? Who said, oh, Risa Young. I am in both, but don't have to go twice. See, that's what I was saying. I mean, you know, uh, uh, there's a lot of people that are in both. And I wanted y'all's opinions. You know, what do you think? Do you think that they should be entered twice because they are Patreon as well as YouTube? I try to be fair, okay? And um, so I wanted to give, you know, everybody the, uh, I wanted to give everybody a voice, you know, and, and let you guys think, um, you know, let you, you voice your opinion on what you thought about, you know, if, 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 uh, if they were a member of two different things, you know, should they be in there twice? Um, so anyway, you are very welcome, Tina Lewis. Congratulations! Woohoo, Tina! All right, baby girl, uh, you have to send me a direct yep. message, uh, yeah. not in chat, it has to be a direct message to me, please. Uh, with your email address, or guess what? You will not get y'all's. <laughs> um, pay twice, enter twice. Scott, uh, Scott's opinion pay twice, enter twice. I, I was kind of thinking the same thing, but you know, again, y'all mull that over, y'all think about that, okay? Because you know, I want to be fair. And, and, you know, um, um, so, you know, it's like, I tried, I want to be fair to everybody. So congratulations to Tina Lewis. And there we go. And now we got Kevin's wife. What you eating? I am starving. Just little fruit snacks. And you don't have <laughs> enough to share with the class. How dare you? He just opened the box, so yeah, I can share. <laughs> so you gotta share with the glass. I don't okay. usually play well with others, but I have enough snacks to go around. All right. So okay, guys. Um anyway. Holy macaron. <clears throat> uh I wanted to say happy birthday to Melissa Azell, Diamond Painting Nana. 
I'm not sure what she calls herself. It was Diamond Painting Nana at one time. Um, anyway, happy birthday to Melissa Zell. Uh, Don Marie has swept her off to a casino somewhere or another. Uh, anyway, okay, let's see. Do, 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 do. Uh, Snuggie's Craft Corner. I think that's fair. Uh, congratulations, Tina Lewis. Okay, toss it over here. Uh, next, why not give some something from your shop? Um, Chris, the reason why I do not, um, uh, 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 give a gift card from Etsy is because Etsy is not specific. I can give a gift card from Etsy, but they can go and spend that gift card in, in anybody else's shop. So usually it was like, well, what the heck, you know, uh, I used to give stuff from my store. Um, it, but, you know, and if somebody come to me and they go, hey, Nix, I'd rather have blah, blah instead of the $25 gift card. <laughs> now, I'm flexible. Uh, you know, I, I don't mind. Uh, so, no, um, you know, that's the only thing. And I want to say again, happy birthday to Melissa Azell. I believe her birthday was yesterday. Uh, her and Don Marie are, are off and doing their thing. Um, and Donna Bass, I'm, I, man, have y'all noticed Donna Bass lately? Oh, she got it going on. Um, also to, oh, I, oh, yeah, I, I, I see what you spent a lot of money on today. I'm going down Facebook and I see, welcome to the family, <laughs> time to earn your keep. Gee, my nitties, how does he, Kevin's not a big dude, how, how, wow, yeah, I bet you he's got jello for arms. Yep, he actually ended up with a, a Charlie horse in his elbow, I've never seen anybody get a Charlie horse in their elbow before, but he did today. How, okay, no, guys, look, guys, y'all want to see, look, uh, here, I'll show you. That was the new toy that they got today. No, 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 right? no, no. There's no they in this. <laughs> oh, it was Kevin. Okay, Kevin got a new toy. Okay, Let's see, be Kevin. Clear. <laughs> Kevin got a new toy today. Um, and if you go over to Kevin's Creation Store, they have fabulous diamond painting pens which kevin oh i don't have them here with me i wish i had them here with me kevin uh made me these two right here they look like this with little hearts on them and in the center has got one of them has got uh rocket's little face and the other one's got sid's whole body and the purple was what i was asking you about but you said it was really fat yes so i'm sorry i can't do fat and this one here, uh, explain your oopsie <laughs> pen. Hang on. So, not not everything goes as planned in the shop. Um, well, of course not. If it <laughs> did, we we would all have wings and a halo, right? So, oops. There's two kinds of oopsie pens. There's the ones that um are like they're okay but they just have like one little thing that was wrong with them like we had a heart pen um that when it was cut <clears throat> on the scroll saw it was cut a little too close to the edge so when when it was turned the hearts ended up blending on the side so everything ah. else about the pen was perfectly fine except for that so that's one kind of oopsie um where it it would be a first run pen except it has this wrong with it um this is one of those pens and that's this one here, that truly there's nothing wrong with it because it, it works just fine. It was just, um, there were a couple spots on the finish where it was just, um, 
you can feel the texture between the two layers and that that wasn't what we wanted so there you go guys um, I, I can y'all see that i'm turning it I, I clicked on the video now here let me tell you this too if you are looking at the um uh, uh, motley dragon okay my trays the motley dragon this pen matches that motley dragon absolutely just dead on okay no joke this has got all the colors in it of the motley dragon so uh this would be a great match to <clears throat> um, that's not the one next Oh, I'm 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 getting there to the other oh. one, but this one would work as well. Um, so, and again, it is. Uh, it's not that big, Jen. Yeah, it's by I, now. This is a perfect size for me. I don't like any. You know, I, I like around the four and a half and a fives. Uh, but anyway, this is pretty cool. Um, now, where the other ones go? Uh, uh, that purple and green, I thought this one was pretty cool too. Okay, for those, for especially for Halloween. Now, if there's an oopsie in this, I'd be doggone if I see it. Okay, because it's like, well, I can see a little bit right there. This that is, looks it is very cool, it is very Joker ish. Um, that's what it reminds me of with the purple and the green. It's actually a translucent pen. So it's very, it's very hard to see, but it has a bend to it. Like it, when he was turning it, it just kind of got a little bit too warm and it started to bend. I can so see it, it has it just top. a little bit of an arch in it. That's, that's really with all. The, the, with the video, if you look at the top, okay. And you watch the video, you yeah. can see where it turns just a hair. But anyway, guys, this is this is it here. I think it's pretty doggone cool looking. Uh, and we okay. always put in the description if there's an if it's an oopsie pen, we always put in the description exactly why it made it to that category. Yep. All right. These are okay. Now I mentioned the other one. Now, the reason why I mentioned it first is because it was an oopsie pin. Okay. Will it match Motley Dragon? Dead on. Yes. Also, too, it's cheaper. Okay. But there's only one. So if you want it and you got Motley Dragon or you plan on getting Motley Dragon, the set. I highly suggest that you run and go get that sucker now because it's only 30 bucks and uh, will not be there forever because there's only one left. Now, this, okay, is the second one that is uh, identical uh, to the Motley Dragon. It literally has every color in the Motley Dragon. Uh, I like D, the only thing, and B, I like B. The only reason why I like B uh, better is because it. I'm not a fan of the squared off tips because I can't see over the end of uh, the squared off tip. Like D. See how D's got that, kind of got that square. But I also like the fact that it's got the little groovy things in it. So, you know, it's give or take. Um, <coughs> and B, these are 40 uh, forty dollars each. One left and in six carts. Let's see. A is sold out. B is sold out. So the only one that's left is C. So girl, all I got to tell you is you better get to making some more. Okay. <laughs> uh, and yes, ma'am. <laughs> I like D with with the round. Hey, Timo. Hi, Dima. Uh, so anyway, she has got 
uh, the only one that's left is C. So if you have the Motley Dragon Diamond Painting uh, tray set, these pins right here will match 100% perfect. And they're 40 bucks. There's one left. And uh, uh, shipping is $3.75. And I can tell you right now from being a past member uh, or past uh, 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 member, uh, I got member on a brain, past buyer. Usually you get your pins within a week, if not sooner. Uh, so anyway, guys, and uh, the, I, I love these. I love these. Girl, okay, we, we like D and we want the B, B top, okay? See the B top? We like the B top, but we like the D, you know, with the, there we go, okay? Uh, so anyway, and, uh, honestly, I was, uh, this is just me blathering on. I threw out a discussion to, um, Mrs. Kevin's wife, uh, about, you know, her and I collabing on colors and what have you. So we're going to get together down the road and, 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 and see what we can come up with and, and what we can do. Uh, so anyway, I wanted to show these to you, not to mention Kevin's got some fantastic wood ones here. I do not understand that pen. <laughs> I, yeah, I don't know where Kevin's brain was at while he was making that, but that one right there just don't make no sense to me. It's pretty wild. And it, it looks like it would be very fragile, but it is actually a very strong pen. I, I have trouble, like, squishing the two sides together. It okay. is a very sturdy pen. I have, okay, I'm going to have to switch. Uh, I'll have to show this in a second. I have the little small cup here. Uh, I love mine. It is, it matches my Motley Dragon. Um, and it is really, really cool. Uh, here is our cover monitors. Love, love, love the turtles. They also do pins. Uh, guys, I have the team <coughs> ripper and scissors uh, for quilters and sewers and cross stitchers. Highly, highly, highly recommend those. Um, and again, uh, Kevin and Erica are, uh, like I am, you know, we're, we're pretty flexible. So, you know, if you don't see something that, you know, what you're looking for, all you gotta do is give me a yell and if they can do it, you know, they will do it. Um, so there you go. And I wanted to throw that out there and let you guys know about that. And so we got the tea ma in the house, busy making enchantment suggestions while Cheryl is here this weekend and drooling over the rainbow pens. Uh, hey, I seen that. Come back here. Where are you going? I want to see that butt. Come back here. There he is. Hi, honey. Hi. How you doing? I'm tired. Did you have fun playing with your new toy today. <laughs> I know nice. boys and their toys. Okay, look, the older they get, the just they cost more money. Is all. <laughs> Amen. Amen. <laughs> oh, honey, trust me, I, I I got it going on, so I know exactly what you mean. The older they get, the more the more expensive their toys become. <laughs> so uh, they still got their toys; they just cost more. So anyway, Kevin, yay on Kevin's. And I wanted to show y'all this. Uh, let me change my thingy here. Okay. Uh, this is the, no, okay. The bats don't belong to you. Uh, this is the little, uh, it comes with the magnet and uh, it is the trash tray. This is the cauldron. Do you still have the cauldrons? We cannot keep those in stock to save our lives. Every uh, time we put yep. cauldrons out, they sell out very quickly. 
I I love this one because again these colors match the Motley Dragon um uh diamond painting set. I mean absolutely perfect. And I got them sit right over here to the side and pretty much using a little, little bad boys for everything. And Debbie Day sent me bats in my in my uh <laughs> order this week. So um I I, I got bats. Um, and let's see, uh, what else? Um, I gotta go by Timon and and get some some of Timon's drills. I haven't been to I haven't been to visit my Timon lately. So my Timon, how you be doing? Uh, diamond painting fanatics. Me, either my memory is shot from info overload these days. Oh, totally know that. Um, so, oh, Tima. Okay, for those of you that are asking, uh, Tima is taking diamond paintings, and if I'm saying this correctly, she is creating kits to go with specific diamond paintings that bling out the diamond paintings okay if i said that correctly uh so when you go to her website um and you see these kits they are specific kits that have specific um you know uh jellies or 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 or, or uh uh Think, Nix, think. Uh, crystals and and uh, the, the quads and what have you. I love the quads. Um, you know, uh, the S for S's, which don't work with my brain. Uh, but anyway, she's got all these set up in kits. So if you buy a diamond painting, and I'm sure if you don't see that kit there, you know, you can mention it to her. Uh, and or either go and surf her site, see what, you know, she has for mm -hmm. blinging out and then go buy the diamond painting. Uh, so that's what Tima has been doing lately. Uh, you know, and unless she's got some other stuff going on in there that, uh, cause her and I have not had a, a chat in a while, but we've both been crazy busy. So, uh, other than a, Hey, and a howdy. Uh, that's been pretty much about the gist of it for me and her here lately. Uh, but as you always know, we love our team on. Doors always open. Yes, I did send her a link to come and play if she wanted to. Don P is throwing rocks at me. Next, there was a kit for Moon Goddess. I am working on Moon Goddess. I just <clears throat> literally started working on Moon Goddess. Um, I've got like the corner done, but usually I, I redid my bedroom. Okay. Now why? Because I'm not never in there, but I couldn't diamond paint in here because I always work in here. Okay. So I'm either doing computer or I'm answering questions or I'm making something. So I took all of my diamond painting stuff and i went and bought what is called like the hospital table that slides under your bed you know uh and a hospital and then i got this from Tima, Ma, who has the um uh, it's a wood board that's got the clips on it that she carries with her when she's traveling so i got one of those and it's a2 size because my laptop is a2 well, the table totally is not A2 size. Um, it's a little smaller than that. But I have just <coughs> enough room in between my nightstand and my dresser to slide that table in and out. And I've I it just fit perfect. I got my light pad there. I got my overhead light. And I've got, you know, my, my kit. It just literally... And very, very rarely do I go, hey, I'm taking a day off and I'll go in there and I'll sit in diamond paint. And my husband, uh, he snores so loud that the neighbors can hear him. 
So, you know, usually I'll try to sneak in there and diamond paint and, and watch my supernatural. But, you know, here goes. That TV's waking me up. Well, stop snoring so loud so I can hear the TV. But I knock on wood, I have not been able to diamond paint in about two weeks. Um, but I did find a happy medium. So, you know, at least I can say I, I am doing some kind of diamond painting. And I did finish Josephine Wall. She is the next to be framed and hung up. Um, I had to get Christmas morning done. Had to get my kid, um, get my kid done. And they're 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 so Christmas happy that that they're literally buying Christmas now, and and Halloween ain't even over yet. So um but anyway um you know they they've got that going on but i'm kind of happy I, i'm working on moon goddess but i will totally go and check out uh tima's uh blingy kit uh the only thing is those s for s's i i'm not a fan um but but this is my opinion okay um Yes, uh, Tima, she has a rainbow, uh, a rainbow trash can. There you go. Whoa, whoa. Let me find my camera here. There we go. It's the rainbow trash can and the rainbow uh, 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 cauldron. However, she is out of stock on a cauldrons. Um, but she has the the rainbow. And it matches the, uh, uh, I like it because it matches. And it, not to mention, the, you use the good magnets on those. So, uh, oh, and this is Diamond Painting Nana's. Um, oh. Uh, her little spinny thing. She's only got like six, seven, ten different kinds. So. Usually I sit here and play with this thing all the time. But uh, thank you, Don P, for reminding me about that. And I will go and check out T Ma's uh, Moon Goddess stash. Uh, but again, uh, the S for S is, is just, I don't know, man, you know, round, round square in a, 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 a round thing in a square hole just don't work for me. Uh, fidget spinner. Yeah. Uh, Nana's crafty gems. Google it, people. Okay. Uh, Nana's crafty, crafty gems O2 on Etsy. She has about 10. Now this is, what is it? The golden snitch. It's a Harry Potter something. Uh, but she has other kinds and they're uber cool. They are like massive cool. Um, and she, you know, she sent me and they spin really, really easy. So uh, I usually sit here and play with this thing. So Mrs. Kevin's wife, y'all were whispering what's going on. Well, we have a spinner too. Ah. So it's a pen. With a pen? It's a diamond painting pen. Oh, check you out. Ain't you getting slick? <laughs> he had done one of these a couple weeks. Well, gosh, it was probably a couple months ago now. That just had the hole in the middle. It was a triangle. So it has three three places where you can put your, your tips. And he just done it with the hole in it. And then he comes to me and he's like, hey, check this out. <laughs> I was like, do we, do we have to sell it? Because... I just wanna, I just wanna play with. <laughs> uh, well, Mr. Einstein, what did I do with it? Hey, come to me with. Hang on, let's see if I can find it in this hot mess that I've got going on. Which, by the way, this is this is their, this is this is how good their their diamond painting their their diamond painting pens are because they were. Uh, the creators of uh, Phoenix Fantasy 2023 Diamond Painting Pins. So I just, I have to show this off. Scott, are you um, asking me? 
Or are you asking about cover minders? Are you asking about the pen or the cover minders? Uh, are you talking to me? Scott asked a question in the chat. Oh, um, hang on. I'm looking for, what did he do? Up, up. This is, this is my husband's version of a spinner. Okay, we do the dragons, right? And so this is the past two years color uh, <coughs> for the dragon. And this year we're doing the blue and the silver, right? So it's red here and it's silver here. And granted, his does not spin as well. But, you know, it's got the double dragons. I, I, I have... I'm still in the process of figuring it out on as what to do with it. So, you know, opinions, people, opinions. Would y'all buy this, you know, or not? Uh, and or I could just make a couple of them and put them in, um, you know, and put them in there. But I'm like you. At least yours has got a purpose. Mine just is there. And, you know, I just sit there and, and, and spin <laughs> okay. it. I, I'd like to point out that if I have this, the only purpose is for me to sit there and do this. Okay. I'm not diamond painting with it. <laughs> That's like this. I, I, mean, I know. I'm just sitting here, you know, spinning this little sucker. I hope I'm not driving nobody crazy. If I am, say so. But uh, do you have anything on your site that I overlooked that you wanted to point out or, or, or anything? Um Scott, I will get back to you on the metal. I'll have to ask him about that. So let me let me let me put a pin in that for him, and we'll get back to you on that. Um, as far as the site, yes, if you can go back. Sure, sure. I'm so sorry. I should have asked earlier. That's okay. I know that that red, um, that one that you've got, that red one, uh, uh right here, guys. Pay attention, okay? Uh, because this one here will match, okay, the uh, Vampire's Desire that I have right this minute uh, that's up uh, with the diamond painting trays. That pen right there is red and black and goes and got, has glitter in it uh, and will go with the Vampire's Desire set just mwah, perfect. So I had to, I had to toss that in there, but okay, yes, ma'am, I'm I'm paying attention. Full disclosure, that's more of a brown. It's meant to be like an autumn one, but the the orange kind of got eaten by the red. So, but there is some gold in it, but it is more of a, it's a very dark brown, but it is brown, not 100 percent black. I still like the purple. I love the design of the purple. I just feel bad because it's fat. Mm -hmm. It's way too fat for me. That and is a very big one. It down. Okay, look, y'all ever want a, 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 a small pen? You go, I want Nick's size, okay? Nick's size is about the size of a Sharpie, a little bit fatter, uh, give or take. And... Um, those uh work for me because they're kind of like you know uh well as we growing up and we're going through school we write with pens every day and we write with uh or let me rephrase that we used to now everybody types um but anyway it you know is about pencil size you know pen size they're about so I, I fell in love with the purple i thought the purple was cool uh, but someone said that it was too fat, so it was not NYX approved. <laughs> and and we'll do that. We when people order a couple times, like we know kind of what they like. And I've said to people, you know, I know you bought this pen, but just so you know, this is not going to be your style. You're not going to like the width of this pen or the length of it or whatever. So I mean, we're going to be we'll be honest with you about that as long as we know your style. Now, uh, let me throw this in real quick. Uh, Day's Dream, Debbie's, Debbie Day's uh, The Wolf, okay? Kevin's Creations uh, is the one that made uh, The Wolf pins, okay? So if y'all have not seen those, man, y'all go over there and go check them out because they, they, it's like a window 
that uh and and i thought this was so cool how you did this um they made a window and in the diamond painting pen that has the picture of the diamond painting in it and the rest of it like the back and and the rest of it is a different color and wood and you know uh the color of the diamond painting you know in acrylic did a is it acrylic or resin or resin i always get them mixed up anyway um <coughs> Yeah, so they made those too. So y'all go check them out, man. They are like uber ass cool. Uh, but I, I got mine. Go look at last week's. I showed it off last week. Go look at last week's uh, YouTube video. Um, and so if yeah, you, you didn't want... give me any warning on that. Thank you. Pardon? I said you didn't give me any warning on that. <clears throat> about uh, about Debbie that you were showing the pens. I was in chat. Had I known, I'd have popped in. Uh, but I'm just giving I, you a hard time. It's okay. Last week was a blur. Last <laughs> week was like, man, my brain was broke down in overdrive, okay? I, I, I was like, look, I had like a 100 squirrels in there chasing, you know, 200 nuts. So uh last week was just crazy for me this week i'm just tired so hey one thing about it i slow down when i get tired uh so i'm sorry darling i would have i would have you know you are welcome and my door's always open and all you gotta do is throw a rock at me go yo give me the link <laughs> So, uh, oh, but if you want, if there's anything you wanted to say about, you know, Debbie's pen or whatever, go, go for it. I can go dig it out if you want me to. Oh no, it's okay. But I was just letting everybody know y'all made it. Cause I thought it was cool. It's not, you know, uh, and they are also making Phoenix fantasy, um, pins 20 Phoenix fantasy 2024. Kevin and Knox are in collaboration uh, to uh, make the art. Um, I have I have uh, commissioned Kevin and uh, Knox to design the blue and silver um, Phoenix for this year. It's called Fire and Ice because um, fire was last year and ice is this year and next year might be a collage of the two um but right now this year is going to be blue and silver and uh i found a t-shirt at three o'clock in the morning and and wrote erica a mini novel at three o'clock in the morning you know going oh look what i found look what i found you know <laughs> and i just bought the shirt i don't know you were here last week you seen the shirt mm-hmm I was wearing a shirt. I finally found it in a long sleeve. Uh, so anyway, um, so, all right, I'm here. I I'm shutting up now. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> well, I'll show you. I'll go over a couple things first, um, but then I'm going to talk about something else, too. So um, so on the on that main page there, actually, if you it might be a little bit easier if you go to the menu on the left hand side of the page and click oopsie. Yeah, that makes it a little bit easier. So you'll see on there. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, so we only have one as an example. And that's this one. Everything else apparently is sold out. Oh, that's kind of wicked. So you can see on the, on the page it says oopsie and then it says coded pen underneath. So these are a little bit different. Um, so these are actually coated either with an entirely different color or they are coated with clear um, just to hide, not hide, but um, smooth out some other defects. So this particular pen, since it's the only one on the site, I do have it here. I have some others that I'll show you. But this one was actually made as a prototype for another client. Um, so we put the whole pen was this rainbow on that's that you see on either side. It was done on both sides. Right. One side's a little darker, one side's a little lighter. So we, we covered up what didn't need to be there with the pink 
and then coated the rest with clear. So there is, there's nothing wrong with the pen itself. It's just, it wasn't, it didn't end up working out the way we wanted. So we just did a coat on it. So that's what the coated pens are. You don't, ah. they already sold out, but this is another one we did. Okay. And so, again, look at the price, 30 bucks. Okay. No joke, guys. Um, these are some, some great, you know, great prices here. Uh, here, hang on, hang on. Wait, let me, let me, let me figure out. Are you going to blow me up? I'm trying. <laughs> uh, there we go. Okay, now show. You showed two. Ooh, I like that one. I really like this one. I do too. Looks and a little can, fat though. And you can kind of maybe. It's I like the tip. I like the tip of it. Okay. It's a little translucent here in the end um, because the, the coating got a little bit thin there. But what's inside this pen was a, a blank that we never were going to sell. And rather than pitch it, we wanted to do something else with it because nothing... Well, we have a hard time throwing anything away, really. <laughs> Welcome to my house. So we coated it. And I, I do really like this. I'm going to do this in a regular pen, actually, because I really like this color combo. Okay, I'll take on the next size. I, the, I will say the camera does not do that one justice. And here's the other one. That reminds me of a caterpillar. Mm -hmm. it, it really does. Cool yeah. colors. I like those colors, but it does remind me of caterpillar. And if you want, I oh wait, wait, no, this one. Because I think this one is still there. Uh yeah, that one is still on the website and it's thirty dollars. Yeah, this is that black and red one that I showed that I teased with the one the other week. Right. Yeah, and again, it's not the camera's not doing it any justice. Do you want to see what's coming uh, that next? That one week? is still there. Do you have the leaf one? Uh, it's it go uh, clear with something in it. It looks like leaves. Oh, this one? Yes, that one. Yeah. What's in it? That one's really pretty. I like those. This was meant to be a. Um... Like a happy new year celebration type. It just, it didn't work out the way we wanted to. So we put a, a nice shiny coat on it. So it has red glitter and fat gold glitter and a bunch of bubbles. It was supposed to be champagne-like. I think it's pretty doggone cold looking, to be honest. Okay. And that one is $28. Uh, now, guys, there's only one each of these. Okay. Okay. And I tell you what, I have not seen a diamond painting pen for 28 bucks. No joke. Um, so I, I highly suggest, let me see if I can get this sucker back up here again. Uh, where'd you go? Oh, you pain in the butt. Uh, you know, it, there it is. Ah, I just need to click the right button. Uh, this, this one here is the $28 one and here you go. Y'all can look at that one. And I really do. I think that one's pretty doggone cool. Um, I don't know. I just always like the clear ones cause you can kind of see through them and you know, what have you. Um, I tell you what though, my end all be all favorites are um and maybe i'm partial because you know kevin um it, you know it's these here because in the <laughs> center right here kevin put a picture and he just went downstairs and he goes zip 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 and he come back and he goes and it was all the way through okay this was not this was not no half and half this was he took a itty bitty teeny tiny little dremel and he drew <laughs> uh rocket's face in the center of this diamond painting pen and then he took another one with the hearts here 
and drew Sid, which Sid's got a really long, skinny body. So I have those two right there. And he made them bulletproof with, for, for Nix. And he made them out of bulletproof wood. So uh, what was the wood again? Uh, we all, we do the darker wood is the, is the black walnut. The whiter wood is the, the lighter wood is the maple. Um, and you have maple. I have the one that you can't kill. So um, anyway, these are uber cool. They're $45 each. Uh, now they do come in different. Okay, like maple chunk and what have you. You do have a different price here. Um, and, uh, but I love mine. Okay. And I, uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, uh, for, for doing mine. Um, and I do, I absolutely love them. Now, the only thing that I can say is in the photos, they don't show how bright the heart colors are and the heart colors are really, really, really bright. So, and they're translucent. You can kind of see through some of them. So, okay. Anything else you want me to show, darling? Uh, breaking anything? I missed anything? Do you want to see next week's? Ah, uh, yeah. Where is it hiding? <laughs> Wait a minute. Uh, okay, there we go. I'm looking. Oops. Oh, wow. This is not coming through on the screen at all. There's the resin here is a purplish white, like nebulous color and it's not coming through. Oh at all. man. I love those ghost colors like that. Yep. Um, what's the brown? Is that brown? <laughs> yep. That's a piece of wood. So this, <laughs> this is from way back when we first started. Um, actually, I think this might have been one one Kevin made very the very first time around when we didn't um, when we didn't really know about you know stabilizing wood and uh, you know all those fun fancy things. So this is going just throwing it way way back. Um, but again, we hung on to that blank forever because we just don't throw anything out. Um, and you know maybe we can make something cool with it one day. So that's what we did. Of course. And it also show it again because it looked oh, yeah. kind of skinny. It looked kind of thin, like Nick's thin. Uh not quite. I tell you what, I love what it it looks like the inside of a seashell. Okay, you know how the inside of a seashell has got every time you look at it and you reflect it, it gives you those different colors. I I think they call them ghost something or another. Um, I I am fanatical for those types of pins, uh, especially for you know because every time you look at them, it's got like a different color in them. Um, hi Diamond Lover, twenty twenty three. It was my first order with you, so I'm excited. Um. <laughs> Uh, first order with who? Me or you? Uh, uh, the Joker pen. I just ordered the green Joker. Ah, there you go. The green Joker pen's gone. It, it's been sold. Uh, oopsies. Uh, yep. Green Joker pen's gone. So, there you go, people. See? Y'all better hurry. Um... And again, if you, uh, I love these, these spider pens, but I don't write letters. I really don't. I would buy oh. one of the spider pens because I think they're, so, I think they're cool. You don't have um, the site up. So nobody knows what you're talking about. Just FYI. Uh, <laughs> I was like, what? I'm like, oh, she's back on the, on the Etsy page. Well, I can get the sucker there. Um, I like these, okay. And again, but I'm not a big writer, you know, I, I don't write a lot. Um, this one here, the center with my neon green and purple. Hello, okay. Does that not scream next or what? 
um, and I don't know what you call that. Uh, what is yeah. this one? Uh, if you look in the description, it should, or in the drop down, it you should got tell chrome, you. gum metal, antique, yeah. pewter, and gold. So yeah, that must be gun. gun. This is gun metal. That this one's is my favorite right there. I, I, I just, I fell in love with this. Um, honestly, if I keep looking at it, I'm end up buying it, you know. Why do I write a lot? No. Other than a note here and there, you know, like on a posty note. And usually I got, I, I, I have a, I have a pocket full of pens here, you know, that I just kind of grab one. But um, anyway, those are really over cool. Uh, also, too, if, again, if you sew and you are a sewer or you do uh, any type of, um, you know, uh, 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 like embroidery or anything like that, they have the seam ripper and the tweezers and uh, you can even get them to wear their dual uh matter of fact i think uh i got the ones that's got the scissors on the end um so they are like really 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 over cool um so yeah not to mention these so there you go uh and there's only one left which you see this one right here is the only one that's left so y'all might want to go and and pick that up because that will match the um uh motley dragon absolutely perfect and you know if y'all don't hurry up and buy it i am so there you go uh but okay is there anything else my lovely this is another one for next week oh wow it is not coming in like Okay, hang on. Let me let me get you. There we go. That one looks like a Christmas tree. And no, it is it is not. Wait, hang on. I'm trying to get you. Hold hold. There we go. Uh that one looks like a Christmas, Christmas tree kind of colory. And actually that's what it's that's what is underneath. This is another whoops. It's not coming through in the in the camera, but you can actually, it's somewhat translucent, so you can see, well, maybe you can't, but I can see the light through it. So I see green and red right. on the inside. So that'll be next week. All right, we're getting all these sneak peeks, okay? So, you and this, know. This next one, just so there's no question, is not for Nick's. It's not for Nick's. No, okay. ma'am, it is not. I can't have it. No, ma'am, you cannot. I don't know who this is for because it's a beast. Uh, yeah, that one's totally it. Uh, honey, that's like using a stick out of the backyard to diamond paint with. Yes, ma'am, it oh is, but it is God. gorgeous. <gasps> look at how cool. you can look at it see through. Oh, and yeah. it's got wood in it. Mm -hmm. Oh, my. Kevin does such a good job with that. And again, this was one of our earlier pens before, um, unfortunately, it was before we were using better quality resin so that you can't see it on the, whoops, on here. But the inside's just a little bit. Um, it reminds me of a crystal ball, you know, because you kind of got the wood on and then in the center, you can kind of see through it. So, wow, that is like crazy cool. Well, there you go, um, Diamonds and Dew, Friday at 2. Uh, some really great friends have very big hands. So, up ah, there you go, Lee. It is, it's uh, a long one, and it's a thick pen, too. Now, I forgot to show this, so I'm going to go back one more time. Share screen, share screen, because I forgot to show this one. Uh, I just seen this one. There you go, guys. This is similar to the one that she was holding up uh, earlier, and I like that one. I like that one, and it's kind of like a patchworky kind of, 
it reminds me of a patchwork quilt because of the different cutouts and you know what have you that's in it so the um, um, the pieces you see in there i think we called that one windows um those pieces there where you see the the purple and blue those are actually clear so those parts of the pen are completely transparent i thought so it looked like you could see through it let's see uh the teal is sold out purple is available and the black is available so that one's available and that one is available it really are uh, and it, on the in and again it doesn't come out in the pictures it's it's just so hard but the inside where the where those windows are there's actually um color in there it, it looks again it looks like a nebula because it's like a rainbow a rainbow shifting color but it, you you can't see it in the pictures right well i think that those are like crazy cool so i remember uh i i don't know i just caught a glimpse of it on the uh, home page and it was like wait a minute where'd that come from i don't remember seeing that so uh, and again, the red and the black and, um, you know, guys, these are, this one here, this red one here, the oopsie red, it looks kind of thin. So I think that that one's kind of like a nyx thin right there, you know, the, uh, the oopsie red and black one. Um, yes, that one is. And that's that actually is not labeled correctly. That is simply a coated pen. It's a wood, um, a wood pen, but it, it's in the oopsie category because it didn't coat the way we wanted it to. <laughs> I think it's pretty. I, I mean, I, I oh, I, it's it's really nice. And like I said, guys, it, it's thirty dollars. There's only one. Uh, so here's the deal, you know, uh, if you want it, you better get it now before it's gone. Um, so, uh, and, uh, uh, this here is a, I'm going to say it's a thin one. It looks really, really thin. Mm -hmm. Um, it is five and a fourth, yep. uh, a little, little longer than five and a fourth, but then also too, you can see right here that it's not really crazy fat. I don't understand why people like these fat pens. I it just, I don't get it. I, I literally, it's like using a log out of the backyard to diamond paint with, you know, you might as well just stab it instead of, um, you know, what have you. Um, and while I'm, I'm sitting here on it. Okay. I'm, I'm being shameful here. Y'all give me a second uh where is um okay here we go share screen exactly snuggy arthritis yeah okay i'm being shameful okay because see i've got two now this is uh fairy uh the fairy lane which will match her um uh, her pins as well but again, the Motley Dragon, um, the Motley Dragon is my, uh, my all-time favorite. Where did he go? Um, this is a turntable for it. Now, everybody no, has been driving me absolutely bonkers about this pen. Okay. Now, sorry, Erica, hang on a second. <laughs> guys can you read okay look at the bottom left what does it say where does that pin come from poshy pins okay go to poshy pins and get it i you know uh it was three o'clock in the morning i thought it's not even a me color i'm you know me i'm like ozzy and biker chick and you know i'm not one for pastel colors but voila there you go and I happened to win it and it matched the colors. So that's why I was saying, you know, also too, so will uh, her little, you know, I use this um, 
with uh you know my motley dragon and you know the colors see this is a short bleed so you literally get eight colors instead of five so and here is the this shows you some of the colors here of all the different colors and then you know again every time it's printed it's printed you know you never know what color you're gonna get but i am being shameful and this is my colors and guys hear me now um i'm gonna show this off there's a lot of these putties dragon's breath uh there's two left when they're gone they're gone um I, i'm getting rid of those for the holidays uh two to one amber fire is most probably gonna gonna go that's still i'm still on an if there um the yubba bubba is going uh candy cane lane is most probably gonna go because i i don't want to turn into a putty site okay so i'm trying to kind of you know make it even um so anyway whatever putties that you want you might you better hurry up and get them now because they're at least gonna go away for um the next three to four months okay maybe brought back in january i can't make any promises because i have got a truckload of other stuff so um you know again i can only have you know, I don't want to turn into a putty site. Oxalotl is staying. Uh, the crown jewels are staying. Um, but, you know, the stuff like the... Honestly, this one here makes me sneeze my ass off. So, you know, when I make it, it's like, hurry, make it. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Uh, next, do you have a color to match the Joker pen? Uh, the Joker pen was green and, um, sweetheart, I have over 100 colors, okay, in, in here. Now, if you look, okay, there is 62 right there, 63, 64, 65 colors by the time I'm done, uh the joker pen you could go with the moss green is pretty cool um i got a lot of greens here's your purples and your greens uh i've got everything from dual colors fluorescent colors to silks and uh over here to your mats now guys let me say this again okay um this tray is a silk, okay? This is silk. You really, really, really don't want to make your trays out of silk. Yes, they're pretty, okay? But the silk is a soft filament, all right? And there is a huge difference in the way that they print and he, this is prime example i mean i'm seeing all kinds of well you guys would most probably not notice anything and think that that's the way it's supposed to be printed but to me i i see a lot okay um bye lee have a lovely evening uh so anyway you know you want to go with matte colors and uh if you do not see a color here that you want uh you know all you gotta do is give me a yell and if i can get my hands on it uh it will be here right this minute like i said i got 62 in stock um and i've got uh three more so that's gonna bring it to 65 now, that does not include the specialty colors, okay? The uh, specialty colors are Unicorn Party and the Raven and Vampire's Dire. Desire, what makes these specialty colors, okay, is because of these right here. 
these these all of this right here is twenty dollars a roll any to anywhere between twenty and twenty five dollars a roll okay i kind of draw the line around the 25 27 dollar mark um now the other ones here okay like the vampire's desire all right this is a red and a red and black that is a forty dollar a roll filament okay so i had to go up on these now you can buy this set together okay well y'all can't see that but you can either buy them one at a time or you can buy them together um but anything that you see singly okay uh out like this those are specialty colors and they're expensive i'm sorry i wish that there was another way that i could do this um but I literally took my regular trays and I added three dollars to each tray. Okay, that that was it, three bucks. And I figured that three dollars should cover um, the extra, you know, on because if you think of a twenty dollar roll of filament, you think of a forty dollar roll of filament. That's you know, that's twice the price. So. Uh, I didn't go astronomical with it. I try not to raid people. Um, you know, uh, that's like right here, the, the sixth place, these trays right here, the P-Rose sell for $7.95. Okay. Um, they come in, this set comes in the 62, uh, colors. But if you bought them separately, they're $7.95 each. If you bought just the lids with the P-Rose, those are $9.95. I'm selling them for $19.95 for the whole set. So that's literally a 50% or give or take. I suck at math. But anyway, that's like a uber, you know, major discount. So uh, I also did um, the same thing with uh this is brand new just listed this this is the shrimp boat you get four shrimp boats you get four lids and the four plugs um and it comes in in 62 colors as well uh so if anybody's got any questions speak now throw a rock raise your hand do something uh i love nebulous nebulous is one of my one of my favorites motley dragon this is the full complete entire set okay you get the turntable you get the six placer pin stand you get all nine trays um and honestly i did find the dragon everybody was wanting to buy the dragon i did find it but the guy won't let me sell it so i can buy the file uh, I can print the file, but I'm not allowed to sell it. He, he's got it locked up pretty tight. So, and if you look at this dragon and you look at that roll of filament, that roll of filament is 14 inches high. Okay. So that is a 14 inch high dragon right there. Um, but anyway, uh, I, I, this is my favorite and I'm not a pastel person. Now, uh, uh, Erica's, where's Erica? Duh. Erica, you didn't do, did you do? Nope. That's Diamond Pen Pals. I have got to get a pen from you. Okay, to see how I got this here, okay, with the pen. Mm -hmm. I have got to get a pen from you to go with um with one of my trays because you know I've got um I I got you know it's not fair for me to have everybody else in there. I, <laughs> You know, uh, well, I, you know, I'm just going to point out you have a Phoenix pen. 
Uh, I do have a Phoenix pen. The only thing is I don't have a tray to go with the Phoenix pen. <laughs> you know, that's Ooh. the bad part. Uh, now, this little yellow one here, this is called Bumblebee. Uh, guys, uh, uh, where did, I don't even know where this pen, uh, pen come from. It was a gift. Somebody gave it to me. So please don't ask me where it come from. I don't know. Uh, I list all information about everything. This here, you can get in the 62 colors. Matter of fact, you'll notice that it's cheaper, um, than the regular one. So there you go. I have tried to think of everything. If I'm missing something, um, uh, you got to yell at me. Uh, now here's another thing too. I have the, um, the pen stand it comes in 18 and 36 okay and that comes the stand and you get either uh the gremlin trays or you get shrimp boat trays so it's your choice you can pick out what you want and you can get either the 18 count uh, which is 149 or you can get 36 count and they're discounted. They, they've already done been, uh, discounted. So if you do the, you do the math on it, there you go. Um, so, you know, uh, I have sold a lot of these and the translucent rainbow, everybody loves this translucent rainbow because, uh, one it's rainbow. Two, you can set it on your light pad and you can see through it. Yolanda Blue, hello, my darling. Come in, come in, come in, come in. Um, and so I've got that that's translucent. And um, I have the... the, 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 the uh, this is a milky translucent here it is i it is from the same company as the tidal wave everybody loves the tidal wave but here's the thing guys i get more people to yell at me about this stupid tidal wave and i'm tired of hearing it okay i can't predict what color you're gonna get it might be blue it might be green it might be a mixture it might be the solid color I can't, I, I didn't make the filament, okay? So all I do is hit the print button. So what you get is what you get. But this is translucent as well. So when you set it on your on your light pad, you can see through it. So um, I, I tried to make something for everybody. Um, and again, my end all be all favorite. I do like Fairy Lane. I got a case of that. And I do, and it comes with the the turntable and what have you. Uh, people that love the, the turquoise blues with the purples, they love um, Mermaid. This is Wisteria Lane. This is the, um, the turntable that I was showing you guys uh tonight the wisteria lane is literally that that green to yellow to purple uh it is a wicked color so um i somebody asked me for this and i went ahead and and i'm gonna go ahead and add it um now mr e is working on a shrimp boat turntable okay and see how this has got six he is i don't i doubt seriously he's going to get the five okay but it's going to be four shrimp boats and um the shrimp boats are these here so what's going to happen is he's going to take four of the shrimp boats which is my number one sellers and he's going to put those on a carousel and they're a little bit bigger. So between the P rows and between the shrimp boats, guys, I don't know what else y'all could ask for. Okay. Because I have literally made everything there is to make. 
except for a box, okay? Uh, Tima will be the box. Okay, everybody has been begging me to make this dog on Velveeta box, and I can't do it. Okay, I just I can't the way it prints and and it just it just takes too doggone long, and it just it don't print good. And I've tried, and we we haven't gave up. We're trying to come up with something. Uh, but anyway, you know, there you go. All right. Any questions before I, because I feel embarrassed talking about my own crap. Okay. So, uh, there is Halloween right there. Vampire's Desire, which is the black and the red. Uh, everybody seems to love the colors. Here is the Vampire's Kiss and the Dark Desires that go with those two. Uh, coming up next, as soon as Halloween is over, I will be bringing up, uh, ribbon candy, okay, and, um, the ribbon candy is, oh, I got, I got papers too, uh, those are new, I also got Alice in Wonderland, that's new, uh, um, Alice in Wonderland washi tape and uh, release papers. Uh, where is it? I have um, lost my ever loving mind. Okay, here it is. Uh, this is ribbon candy. You guys named this. Y'all picked it out last year. Y'all named it. Um, I am going to go ahead and I am going to print the six placer pin stand. I am going to print the uh, the turntable and the stackable to go with this. And also, um, I'm going to try and make a red and green ribbon candy putty to go with it. I have no clue what I'm going to put on the top yet. Uh, but anyway, this is going to be the next feature for the holiday season is this right here. I don't do browns. I do have a brown, but they don't sell. So anyway, guys, there you go. Uh, also, too, I wanted to let y'all know the um, the drill washer. Okay, I've only got a couple left. They're out of stock. The comp the corporation company that I buy them from are out of stock. Uh, I have two left. If you want them, you better get them because when they're gone, they're gone until the company restocks or decides to restock or I can find someplace else to buy them. I sell the hell out of these things. And they're really great because what you do is it opens up and you put your drills in there and you get a coffee cup full of Dawn dishwashing liquid. And it's got that little plunger on there. And you you literally wash your drills and then you rinse it and you take your drills and you open it up and you put your drills on a paper towel, rub them off and then take and put them on a dryer sheet and it washes the drills, gets out auto static. I mean, gone, static, gone, gone. Um, but I've only got two left and I'm, I, I don't know why the company's having issues. Uh, I got some new washi tape coming too. I got Christmas washi tape coming. So, uh, anyway, there you go, guys. If you want it, you got to speak your piece about it. All right, I'm done. I'm, I'm tired. Of, everybody goes, you don't ever talk about your stuff. Okay, there you go. I did. So, and I, I, I feel bad talking about my own stuff. No, you don't. You shouldn't. <laughs> I shouldn't. I do, though. I feel like I'm, like, you know, forcing stuff down people's throats. and I, you know, I totally get that. It's like, yo, dude, it's over there. You want to go look, you know? Uh, but, uh, again, you know, everybody goes, well, you talk about everybody else's stuff and you sell everybody else's stuff, but you don't ever talk about yours. And then when I do... I feel bad because I feel like that's all I've done is, you know, I don't mind showing new colors because it's like, okay, here's a new color. There you go. Have fun with it. 
Um, but to go to the website and, you know, sit there and spend gobsmacks of time there, you know, it's just kind of like bragging on yourself or something like that. And I'm just not that away. So, uh, so anyway, you have got to get me a, a, a pen to go with, uh, let's see, what do we got? Uh, that's a good point, Tammy. What? She uh, said we wouldn't know anything if you didn't. So if you didn't talk about true. it, they wouldn't know anything. But everybody goes, we know how to finish your sentences now because we know what you're going to say each week. And I'm like, <laughs> oh, God, that's bad. Uh, let's see. I have the Raven. I have Unicorn Party. Um, I have the Fairy Lane, which does not... Um, have this is fairy lane right here um this one here is the uh your cloud screen, dancer your screen's not up next i'm sorry thank you yep. uh anyway what i was talking to you anyhow uh so go and pick a color and you know i need a pen to go with the stuff and you can see what's got a pen and what doesn't okay on the confetti carousels um, and because I think I've only got uh three pins that are on the confetti carousels, but believe it or not, man, everybody's like going gonzo over these pins. So, um, give me your best of your best, you know, uh, to go with one or you know, we'll sit down and come up with something on what do you think would be a good color. Um, okay. So far, the number one pen that everybody is like going gaga over is the um, the Motley Dragon Poshy pen, and I think it's because it's rainbow. Mm -hmm. and That's got a very nice pen. pen. But then, honestly, I seen that color on a, a lot of people's uh websites different pin turners it was like a wave man all of a sudden everybody was selling this color and i don't know who made them uh because i know people make blanks and they sell blanks um so whoever made the blanks they must have made a lot of them because uh, that color was on a lot of people's different um, uh, pen selling things. Like, I know what the hell I'm talking about. But I don't. <laughs> I don't know one pen from another. I got two hands. Okay. Uh, I am not a pen person. But at the same time, I do know me having one of um, Erica's pens on, you know, Phoenix Fantasy that gives them advertising as well, um, which I put your, you know, their business cards when you get a Nix's Notions item and in the little goodie box. Um, y'all will notice one of their, uh, uh, business cards is in there as well. Um, I don't think you gave me, uh, uh, are uh, you and Kevin decided not to do the, I'm looking for the banner. Um, uh, we do not have a code now. Uh, that was the only thing that I was going to ask you about. Um, there you go. Kevin's creation store. Anita, you're slipping. You forgot to tell me. Change. Anita's always throwing rocks at me. Change your banner. Change your banner. Um, uh, so anyway, there you go. Um, but no, that was the only thing. But again, you know, you would, uh, I put on your card due to the fact that you have no way of knowing who is coming from me and who is not, okay? Because there's no code. So I put a little note down on the bottom, tell them Nick sent you. Mm. Yeah. And we do, when we get a new order, we ask folks where they go, where they, you know, how they found us. So 
So well, I didn't know if and, people were, you know, if, if, see, I need to know if it's doing any good or not. Mm -hmm. You know, is is the the deal or not? I need to know if it's doing any good. If it's not doing any good, then I need to change strategies because it's all about, um, you know, promoting and driving traffic to your site. That's like Tima. Uh, I advertised for Tima for two years, uh, and so you know, I mean, and it drove traffic to her site and what have you. And that's like Poshy Pins. Poshy, trust me, Poshy Pins just got a boot, uh, you know, a serious boost uh because of the pen and i had no clue i didn't even think about it it was just like hey this matches this this matches this put it together take a picture and i and my pictures suck i suck at taking pictures and somebody was telling me use black was that you oh with the pictures yeah that's why we switched because it's white is just such a pain in the Patoot, it's too hard to white balance with a white background unless you have I a really good. I don't have a black. I have a blue. Uh, some of the mm. sometimes it'll it'll do, and sometimes it don't. It looks really good with the white and um, and the uh, like the lids, you know, that I have. It does really good for that. Uh, I tried it with the I think it was Fairy Lane trays. And it was just, yeah, no, this ain't gonna work. Uh, so I ended up deleting all of them. And I could have used the blue with the Cloud Dancer, but you know, honestly, photo, excuse me, photos are the bane of my existence. They really are. That's why it's like make everything and then take pictures. That way I go picture, 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 done, 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 throw the crap. <laughs> you know, because you got to break out the box. You got to get the little turntable thing. And then you got to adjust the lighting. And then you got to change it from blue to yellow to pink to whatever. And it's like, oh, my God. And then my phone sucks on taking pictures. And then I got to edit the pictures. And then and then them none, 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 none. And it's like... Yeah, that's that's yeah, why don't. nobody talks to me on Thursdays. I I don't, I don't. <laughs> I just I can't. You do what is that when you do your photos is on, girl? I don't know how the hell you so damned organized. Okay, because me it's like <laughs> I'm I'm glad that I that I appear organized. Yes, yes. Yeah, because you know now that's now I have to admit when I'm in a groove. Okay, like last week. Um, I don't think I talked to anybody last week because I was in that role. Matter of fact, I literally, my head, I fell asleep and my head hit this desk <laughs> and I lean the chair back and it's like, okay, I'm going to take an hour or two hour nap. Girl, I slept nine hours in this chair and it was like. I was so mad with myself because it's like, I don't have nine hours to waste. You know, that's wasted time sleeping. And, but I was on that roll and it was like, I was not about to stop. And I'm praying that I can pick that roll back up again because with my ADHD, I can sit here and look at it for a month and go, you got to do this. You got to do this. You got to do this. And do I do that? Uh-uh. <laughs> you got to do it. But, yeah. And, I, but I, I, I'm liking what I'm doing. I got some really cute stuff um, that is, I got some cute little snowmen and, and, I've got every cookie, Ooh. Christmas cookie in the world. Oh. Oh, what? If you, can you bring our site back up again? Sure. Uh, let me get there. It should be there. Yeah. And then let me go back to this thing. All right, and share screen, share screen, share. There you go, darling. What you want me to show them? Okay, so if you scroll up to the top where it has the shop and like the announcements, 
Uh, yep. And you might have to click the read more. Can you see what it says there? Big business announcement coming soon. Check our IG or BF page for more information and a contest. Next diamond painting pin drop Friday, 11 Want a sneak peek? Follow us on pin previews, IG, uh, 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 Instagram, and Facebook. Yep. Yeah. There you go. So we're doing an announcement um, related to the business next Friday in the evening. So um, we're not saying anything about it now, obviously, but we are running just a little contest and letting people guess what the big announcement is. So they can comment on the post that's on Instagram or they can comment on the post that's on our Facebook page You're um, with their guesses. You're pregnant. <laughs> I will neither confirm nor deny because people are guessing. Um, but it's a big business announcement. That would totally affect the business, okay? Oh, all right, me. all right. I'll, I got to hand it to you. But um, I will neither confirm nor deny because you'll just have to wait until next Friday. Oh, my God. Are you really pregnant? Like, seriously? I didn't even know y'all were trying. <laughs> you just woke Kevin up. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> so anyway, uh, so yeah, our Instagram Oh, no. Oh, no, you turn it right back around. You go back to where we were at, okay? You turn this car right back around. You go back to where we were at because, uh, you know, that does affect the business. So do I, I get a confirmed that. yes or no? I, I understand that, but I'm not going to answer yes or no because we have now opened this up to the public to be able to guess. So if I confirm or deny, then that will ruin guesses. So I'm not going to do that. Well, I knew I shouldn't have told you. There's a huge difference between being pregnant and a diamond painting pen. Okay. <laughs> so, I mean, if you're coming out with a new type of diamond painting pen, that is totally ass backwards in a North 40, you know, from being pregnant. So let's go back and talk about the pens. <laughs> <laughs> yes, dear. All right. I'll let it go. Only because I love you. Thank you. But when I talk to you on Monday, I expect you to tell me. Oh, okay. <laughs> I am good at keeping secrets, though. So, there you go. Uh, Kevin's like, what? <laughs> yeah, he literally just woke up. He's like, and he just laughed. I'm sorry, I should have been paying attention to your game. My bad. What? What? <laughs> and so you didn't die. Oh. Well, it's his fault he fell asleep in the middle of his game, but well, I, at least he didn't die. What's he I, playing anyway? Uh Dragon Ball Z. Ah. But oh. I usually like if he comes under attack, I'll wake him up so that, <laughs> so that he doesn't die and lose all his stuff. I want to play uh, Horizon Zero. I done played Horizon Zero Dawn once, but I got to go back and do it again. And then they got Horizon Zero West, and then they got another one uh, for my oh. PlayStation 5. Brand new PlayStation 5, and I've only touched it twice. Um, I like the Horizon, I, the Horizon games. I don't play. I just watch and get very involved in them. I think I'm going to take January off. Uh, I... I <laughs> I said last year I was going to take November and December off. And I don't think that that's a good time to take off because people are buying stuff for gifts and holidays and, you know, what have you. Um, so, I, I mean, I don't know. You know, I figured I'd take January off. 
I my brain needs a break from this. I just need to turn off my brain. And honestly, how I do that is I get I, I video game, you know, and but you're gonna lose me for a month. You know, that's that's the thing about it. I'm not like Kevin. I can't pick it up and put it down. That's oh, like he doesn't. That's like, a t a, you know, watching a, a TV series. I can't pick it up and put it down. Once I start, you ain't going to see me it's again until it's on. over. Oh, okay. What did he Sorry. say? He His said, phone yes, was you're blowing fine. up, and I just didn't understand what was going on. Everybody's asking him about congratulating him on being a dad. <laughs> All right. So we're just going to move on. <laughs> but yeah, Kevin does the same thing. And Jen, because we're doing, we have, how many shows are we doing? Two. Two. Only two? Well, three if you count the March one. But yeah, oh. Just Maryland and, uh... Okay. Yeah. So we're doing two two craft shows this this fall and we always make um make things for gifts and stuff for christmas and stuff like that so come january it's like done <laughs> and he just he veges out playing his games in fact wow. i i got him one last christmas it was a pre-order of the new assassin's creed and he was all set to start. And I said, no, you can't do that until January because I need to watch. <laughs> he he disappeared. Okay. I got a, um, baby was there anything else you needed me to show on your page? Um, uh, I don't think so. I think we're good. Okay, well, Thank well, you very much. Back. We can come back. Uh, cause my husband just put this in my hand. So I, okay. Uh, where's me? That's you. So first for us. This is me. Uh, okay. Mr. Einstein's very proud of this. Um, this wow. is the translucent clear uh, turntable. Okay. And the whole thing is done. It's pretty wicked looking because, see, you can see. Remember when there is a tray gate? Yes, I remember. I'm mentioning that. And I told everybody a tire is a tire, right? And you can't see inside the tire, but they're all round and they all look the same. Well, it's how they're made. So, and see now with this being translucent, you can see how this is made and how all of the things are done. Um, and so, it, well, this, I'm not sure how good that's doing, but, um, anyway, he's proud of this, this clear, uh, turntable that he did. I'm not sure what customer ordered this, but she ordered the, uh, there you go. Ooh, it's flittering. Uh, she ordered the uh, clear turntable, so he's really proud of that. Now, when you get the stackable, okay, this is, I am so glad that he didn't have this on there yet. When you get the stackable, this is what the back of the stackable is going to look like, okay? The only thing that it's missing is the little wheel. And what this does is they literally stack like pizzas on top of each other. Um, we were talking to somebody trying to figure out how we could, um, you know, like if somebody had the turntable and then had like, um, four or five of this, the stackables, you know, like this year with no turntable on the back, how they could, you know, kind of like, uh, you know, like a cake carrier, you know what I'm talking about? Mm hmm Okay. We was trying to figure out and opened his suggestions on how to uh, connect them together so they're carryable. Uh, or, because uh, they stack 
And if you grab the bottom one to move it, it, it would do good. Um, and he thought about, you know, like the clips that would, like the C clamps that would go on the side that would clip. Um, we also thought about, um, like, uh, coaster you know like the little thing that your coasters come in and your coasters set in so i think that's what we're going to end up doing is <laughs> like that but anyway i apologize for interrupting you but my husband was very proud of this and wanted everybody to see this this is what the clear uh turntable looks like uh i can honestly admit i do not use and or like white diamond painting trays okay they blind me i can't see the colors very well um so i stay away from white uh some people can they can use them they love them and some people can't due to the fact that these are translucent um, one, you can set the whole thing on your light pad and see through the whole thing. Uh, two, uh, they, they are not blinding like the white is. Um, the white, I don't know, me and that white just don't get along. Um, if you look at your diamond paintings, regardless of what company you get them from, Nine times out of ten, those trays are green, okay? The reason why the trays are green is because green is the only color that you can literally see all the colors in, okay? If you go with a dark tray, you can't see the dark colors. If you go with the light tray, you can't see the light colors. So with the green, that green scientists literally, you know, science did this, this stuff to death. <laughs> um, and science. yeah. So apparently uh, the green uh, was a good color for the eyes. Okay, and being able to see all of, you know, if we got a science person in the house, they might be able to explain that. Um, which, by the way, did we ever turn off Twitch? Yeah. Okay. Uh, anyway, I'm not sure who ordered this. I can't remember who ordered this. Um, but anyway, this is the turntable, confetti turntable in clear. Uh, first one that we've ever done. Uh, turned out pretty darn cool. You can't read my name very well. Um, and, but at the same time, it's really smooth. Um, these are one eighth inch thick. It is one inch high. So if you stack these, just remember, um, they're one inch each. One inch each, so that means that um one I really do need to there we go. They are one inch each, so that means that uh you know every time every one that you stock is going to you know be an inch. So there you go. Uh but all right. Again, there goes me talking about my 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 stuff. It's okay because I'm actually looking at your at your colors right now to pick out um colors for uh diamond lover. For what? Uh Diamond Lover 2023. She had asked about the um colors tray colors to match the pen so i'm actually just looking to see which colors match best. oh hi diamond lover i'm sorry sweetheart i didn't see you come in my apologies what's that green can you hang on what there we go never mind the bright green and the deep purple i think those are the two that would match the best I'll type it in so she has it. Um, the, the, okay, on, I've got two, okay, I got hot rod green, which is a silk. 
I have key lime pie, which is kind of a yellowy green. Um, here, hang on a second. Okay. Um, the hot rod green. Okay, because you're looking for the Joker colors, right? Yeah, they did the bright green and the deep purple, which is the two. Those are the two I had pretty much narrowed it down to. So. Well, the um, the bright green. Now, this is a silk, okay? Um, and then your deep purple, the darkest, deepest purple that I have is grape ape, okay? I sell the crud out of that one right there. Um, and as you can see, now this is emerald green right here on the right. So uh, that's kind of a joker green. But I called it emerald owls because it reminds me of the Wizard of Oz. You know, with that green. Uh, it would be good for the joker green as well. Uh, now if you really, really, really want to uh, jump out, slap you joker colors... That's these two down at the bottom, and that's the deep purple and the bright green. Uh, those two right there are slap your mama, okay? They are bright. They are bold. They are, um, they are you know, almost as close to neons, kind of like these here. Um, but this is, this is dimmer. Uh, than these two here. These are brand new. Just got them. And if you are looking for a translucent yellow dandelion, for some reason or another, dandelion is a translucent color. It's not supposed to be, but it is. So anyway, there you go. Uh, hopefully that helps. And uh, if you need me to send this to you, I can. If you want me to send you this image uh um, oh, no i have it i found it i was on my phone well i was fixing to say you should be able to just you know copy it uh um, i zoomed in on my phone okay uh again guys the only one that sold out is this uh rainbow color here uh that was the crappiest ugliest color i have ever seen in my life it was uh, it was a muddy mess. If if you understand what I mean by muddy, it wasn't uh, bright or vibrant. Uh, it was just just you know very dull colors. So uh, matter of fact, I returned it. I returned it to the company. I was like, nope. This one, the silk peach. That one's really pretty. That one's two colors. It's a pink and a yellow. Uh, and it's really, really, really pretty. Um, that one's a brand new color. Like brand spanking new color. Uh, this is a two-tone purple, two-tone blue, two-tone um, um, gold and uh, a brown and an orange. And then this is a two-tone pink and white. Pink and white, blue and white, and purple and white, I think, is what those are. So, yeah, these are your color changing over here. Uh, green to yellow, orange to yellow. This is my number one seller is that I have always had, and that is the pink to purple. Uh, the blue, uh, the white to blue uh, just is, that was a brand new one as well. So, uh, I, I just constantly, I'm constantly on the look, uh, for new colors. I, I'm like a kid in a candy store when it comes to, you know, new colors. Uh, cause it was like, uh, all right, I like that. I like this. I like, you know, so, uh, anyway, oh my goodness, guys. So, what have you got going this week? 
Oh my gosh. More pens, more sun catchers, more craft show stuff. <laughs> I haven't even seen those sun catchers. I know. I'm left out. Well, I actually, I'm pretty excited about one that he did because um, it's a sun catcher right now, but we're going to convert it to a cover minder. It's a little fairy and it's, it's really, really super cute. So I'll be excited. Aww. That will be a project for later down the road, but we'll get there eventually. Oh, well, that's cool. Yeah, it's really cute. I don't know. Yeah, we don't we don't have them in the shop right now um, because we're just taking everything to the craft show. And then after the craft show, we'll have them on the site. We had some for Halloween, I think, last year. But, um, you know, we'll have them. Oh, excuse me. So sorry. All right. <laughs> All right. You know. I haven't got woke up much, and here you are yawning in my face, girl. I am, I am Dr. Peppering it to death. Just a question: Was there a code for Kevin's pens? Just curious. That was from Jennifer in the chat. Uh, Jennifer, one, I apologize that I'm two hours late answering your question. I was and, say what? Um, two, um, uh, Jennifer. Oh, I think I was going to say I had answered that one. Okay. Uh, I answered that in, in there. So, um, and Miss Tina Lewis, I received your email and I will get you. I have not received an email from the other winner as of yet. Uh, so make sure that you message me, please, uh, with your email so I can send you your $25 gift card. <laughs> and that was um, Tammy... Simmons, Tammy, message me whenever. And uh, I've already got Tracy Lewis. So, okay. So, who bought what today? Nada. I wish I could say Nada. I used my coupon cards. I got my cat, though. You got your cat? The cat diamond painting. Uh, Hang on. You want to be a little bit more specific. Yep. This one. Oh, okay. Yeah, I found that somebody um I had oh my gosh, it was like three months ago. I put something in a commented in a D stash group that I was looking for it, and somebody commented and they had it. Oh my gosh. So I got that. Yay! I'm surprised you ain't done that. What is it? Sneaky kitty or sneaky cat or I don't mm. know. The one that's got all the colors on it that's in every store you can think of. Yeah, not a. I, that one just doesn't speak to me. It don't speak to me either. But I'm not a cat person. <laughs> um, I got Randall Spangler's Castle which I ended up using, um, yeah, I ended up using my points for that one and ended up paying a dollar and a quarter for it. So it was like, okay, that works. And I went back and I got um, the three squares, the snow globe one, uh, the snowman, and what was the other one? Um, what was the other one? Where'd you go? Um, let's see. 
I got the uh, snow cabin ornament, Jolly Snowman, and I got my draw. My draw, M Y R T E L. It was like, okay, that is so me at Christmas time. Uh, the bird, it says ho, ho, ho on it. The expression on his face was like, okay, that is so, so me. Myrtle. Myrtle? Yeah. Is that Myrtle? Okay, I got Myrtle. I'm Myrtle at Christmas time. Starting uh, starting November the 1st at 12.01 a.m., I am Myrtle. Uh, so, yeah. And I might work on Myrtle, but... Uh, Nefertiria, we are live. Any M-E-A-G-R-T-E-R-A. We are live on YouTube in Saturday Night Live at the moment. Oh, Nefertiria just popped up in the chat. Uh Nefertiria, I always call her Nefertiti. She's my queen of the Nile. Uh, I'm just the queen of denial. Huh? Queen of what? Denial. D E N I A L. Oh, queen of denial. <laughs> I know she picked on me there forever because I used to call her Nefertiti, and they go, her name is not Nefertiti, it's Nefertiria. And I'm like, wait a minute. Well, I like Nefertiti better, Nefertiti better, because the fact of uh, she was, you know, she's a queen. Hey, if you're gonna be anything, be a queen. Uh, there she is. I'm here, baby. So he's like, yeah, man. If you're gonna do anything, you be a queen. Um. Put a few of my wish list can of. For oh Jim, I know the feel uh Jen M. I know the feeling. Um I am fixing to go through my stash. I've got I have got to go through my stash and um literally just unload uh I got so many rounds in there. My stash is touching the wall. It is Jenga laid out. No joke, it is Jenga laid out. And it, I got one and a half rows left and from floor to the ceiling. And that's not including the other ones that are laying on the floor beside it. So, uh, yeah. And I have got to go through, and I don't do rounds. I don't like rounds. Uh, they just, they, uh, they, my brain just does not like rounds. So I'm going to go through and most probably put them all on my website and sell them. Uh, you know, because I've, I've still got the Diamond Art Club boxes that they come in. You know, the ones with the diamonds on the box. Uh, I've got all, the, all those. Add Kevin's wife. Yes, confetti overload. <laughs> uh and who is it, Tammy? Somebody said yes on uh, the purple and the green. Whoever you were talking to about that. Okay, my husband is freaking freezing me to death here. I well, I am freezing my butt off. And I am sitting on top of an air. No, ma'am. Uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. oh uh, sorry. I <laughs> thought I hit the mute button first. Hey. Nope. Mama's yelling at the kitty. Hold on. I'll be right back. Uh-oh. Now she's going to beat the kitty. Don't kill the kitty. That or poor Kevin, one or the other. But she said no, ma'am. So I think she was talking to the cat instead of Kevin. Um, Nefertiria, uh, honestly, sweetheart, I just, um, I just don't do rounds. And the reason why is because I'm a graphics designer and as a graphics designer, you got pixels, which are squares. And the more 
squares you have per inch, the better the image is going to look, okay? So when you use rounds, rounds is going to give you a fuzzy image. Um, it'll never look clear. And so that's why, um, you know, it was like uh, I was looking at the Christmas ones that they have. Uh, and I'm talking the big ones. And I was looking for one, you know, like Christmas morning. Christmas morning was crystal clear. Um, I don't know who, you know, their their render person is, but they are not doing a good job this year. That or either they ran out of colors. I don't know. Um, but I have not found anything as of yet that matches Christmas morning. Been here in a while. I've been suffering. You guys have slept through my 48th, October the 14th. Well, Nefertaria, we you been missed. I know that. I was wondering where you were at. And happy 48th on October the 14th. Uh, oh, my goodness. You did a Hannah Lynn that was on point. Yep. Hannah Lynn's are good. Hannah Lynn's are, are, are on point a lot. Emil, I am literally teeth chattering cold. I can't put on any more clothes. I'm in a blanket and and two three pairs of socks. Be right back. Needs a snack. Mutter, what kind of snacks you getting? Share. Good night, Aaron. Love you. Yeah, we're not going to be here much longer either. I'm waiting I'm waiting for Erica to come back from beating the cat. So, but uh we've been 4 hours 15 minutes and hey, I haven't broke any records in a while, but I'm tired and so we made it for 3 hours last week. <sighs> hey, we lost did we lose diamond painting fanatics? Yo, Cindy Michelle, do you run off? Oh, I think I lost all my mods tonight. I don't think anybody's left. Hey, if you one of my mods, speak, you, speak uh, raise your hand. I think all my mods left. So, uh, everybody's busy. Scott's, I didn't realize it was another raccoon. Uh, who, where did I see raccoons? Uh, Cindy Michelle, Diamond Painting Fanatics, has got raccoons. And she's got some cute ones. So, ah, there's Love and Sparkles. She's still here. <laughs> I was being say, all my mods done ran off and left me, ma'am. But, uh, no, she's got, um, she's got a lot of diversity uh on her her site so you know i and i love i cannot wait uh for um uh the alice in wonderland cat in a hat i am not an alice in wonderland person i love the video game that is 100 years old um and played it forever but at the same time, again, it's a couple of little odd and in, you know, uh, Alice in Wonderland things. But that diamond painting that she had, uh, I absolutely fell in love with it. And it was like, oh my gosh, man, I wish they'd hurry up. But uh, anyway, it is like over three o'clock in the morning you know uh oh uh, it might be daybreak now uh for cindy michelle 5 20 in the morning about 5 20 in the morning she fell asleep just trying to get the giant chuck pinson done uh i have not done a chuck pinson i think i have one uh somewhere i would have to go look 
Uh, I am not a Chuck Pinson fan. I, who am I? Who do I like the best? I buy Cheryl Baker, sight unseen. I buy Christopher Lovell, sight unseen. And uh, Sarah Richter, I buy her, sight unseen. Uh, those three right there, all you got to do is tell me their names. And, you know, if something's coming up, it's like, yo, it, it goes in a card. I don't care what it looks like. I got a bunch of uh, mystery ones that I got to do. Um, I have never done a mystery one yet. And I got a truckload of them. But there's a there's a mystery group on, on Facebook that usually I'll know what it is before I'll buy it. And if I like it, I'll go ahead and buy it. Um, and if I don't, then I won't, I, I won't get it. Yeah, Cindy, which pencil are you working on? Good night, Tammy. I'm not far behind you, baby. To be totally honest, I'm hungry and I'm working on... Oh, no. Welcome back, Mother. What snacks did you get? Uh, Love and Sparkle says the pension she is working on is almost heaven. Good night, Tammy. Have a lovely evening. Thank you for coming. Damn it. I feel like a Chuck Pinson is something I'd have to work up to. It's not that hard. If you've done a J-Wall, you can do a Pinson. Um, oh, I did that one as soon as it came out. Beautiful. Good night, Tammy. Um, I did say good night, Tammy, right? Good night, Tammy. Okay, if I didn't, there you go again. Uh, short short brain laps <laughs> um nefertiria mm -hmm. we've been live for four hours and 20 minutes you you've been missing it darling uh the rest is a potato dinner uh with lots of butter and salt on them oh my god mother i'm starving um that's what we got tater soup in there from my favorite restaurant I'm debating on attacking mm. that. I just found a new salt that I am absolutely head over heels in love with. It is phenomenal. It's salt? A, mm -hmm. It's a truffle salt with Parmesan and garlic. Oh my gosh, it is so good. All right, that's right up his alley. Who makes it? Kinders. Okay, there you go, honey. Truffles, tr truffles, what now? <laughs> it's truffle salt with Parmesan and garlic. That's definitely right up his alley. It is so, so good. Gonna do Snow Queen in December, J Wall. Oh my God. That one is so cool. Oh, uh, I wish it, man. See, here's the thing. Okay, you can get J Walls anywhere. But the rendering of them, I have yet to find anybody as good as when Diamond Art Club had them. They were crystal clear. And now, yeah, you can get the J-Walls anywhere, but the, the renderings of them are just, you know, just not as good. I'm working on Pinson as well. It's the Sweet Garden. I am working on, I don't know who did it. Uh, the Moon Goddess. Uh, who, who, who did the Moon Goddess, guys? I can't remember who did that. Uh, I, Brandy, I agree. Dax J walls are the best. I have not bought another one since. 
And I'm finicky about my, my J walls. I go to the D stash groups a lot and they have a lot of J walls, uh, DAC J walls, but they're open. Okay. And you don't know what kind of condition they're in. A lot of people keep their diamond paintings in their garages. Well, what they don't realize is the heat and the winter uh the summer and the winter affects the diamond paintings okay uh the heat dries up the glue in the winter in the summertime and in the winter time it plays hell on the drills um mine that's why mine's piled up in the middle of my living room floor uh it's under um you know, uh, uh, what is it? Uh, what is controlled temperature controlled? There we go. Controlled environment. Temperature controlled environment, and they're mint. They're not even opened. As I come, I stop doing uh, unboxings. <laughs> they are literally mint in box. I am sitting on a glorified piggy bank of about three hundred and fifty diamond paintings. Uh, do I have plans to do them all? Yup. Except for the rounds. I got no, I got no desire to do rounds. Um, it, you know, it's going to kill me to get rid of a good picture because it's round, but I know what it's going to look like. Um, that's like, uh, uh, Knox. Instead of buying the diamond paintings, I literally bought her lithographs. Uh, had them framed and hang, hung them on the wall. I'd rather go to the artist and buy the buy the art from them if I can't get a good uh, diamond painting print. Oh, which by the way, I wanted to tell you guys, uh, go check out uh, DAC, uh, DAC on uh, Amazon. They've expanded. They've got their own yes. store now. Yeah. They have, got, they have a they strawberry have, shortcake and a mad. <laughs> they've got the expensive stuff and the cheap stuff. So, you know, they've, they've literally got all spectrum. So, um, I know that I've seen one of the $100 ones on there. So go check them out. Um, but I didn't know. I know everybody knew that they sold on Domino Art Club. But I didn't know if they uh, knew that they had updated. Uh, Tammy Simmons. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, my darling. I will get you your uh, gift card to you. Most probably uh, tomorrow, okay? If not Monday at the latest. Uh, and because usually uh, after I get done with uh, uh, what I am doing right this minute, usually I turn this monster off and I don't look at it again until Monday. So, uh, yeah, I did a search on Amazon. I was looking for something. It was Diamond Art Club related, and it popped up with the strawberry shortcake, a small one, not the big ones that they did, but a small one. It was, I think, 20 by 20. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know. But it popped up, and I was like, what? But it says unavailable. So, I don't know if it's if it was there and it sold out or or if it's like a coming soon and was just a glitch, but uh, yeah, I need to be a little um, bit more on my Amazon game there. I would just keep, I mean, now granted, most of them was, you know, the crappy little looks like five-year-old did it. Um, you know, so, uh, you know, it's a hit and a miss. So, but they do have some good ones there. They do have some that, yeah, I, I, it, they're not worth having. Um, and what, what kills me is I'm not going to pay uh, a crap ton of money for something that looks like a five-year-old colored it in a coloring book, you know? So well, I think they're doing it. And I think it's a pretty smart decision to try and compete with the, the generic 
China stuff that you find. On Agreed. Amazon. And I'm not, I'm not putting those pictures down or anything. You, you get what you, you, you know, you do what you do. Um, but for them, it's a way of competing because a lot of those are the smaller ones. So now DAC is putting out those smaller ones in an attempt to compete with that. So I think it's a pretty brilliant move on their part. And it's, I mean, now the pictures may not be, well, you know what happens when you have a small picture, you don't get a lot of detail. So they have to make the picture more basic. So. Uh, I'm going to be right back again. I know. Okay, here we go, people. All right, this is Amazon, as y'all can tell, up here at Amazon. This is Diamond Art Club on Amazon. Um, and let's see, shot by category. Uh, it's pretty basic. Now, um, I do the... Shop all. There, there we go. Shop all. Um, and they have, you know, the little ones. Now, here's the thing. You've got to watch the size, okay? It might look like the same picture that they have on the website. Um, thank you, D thank you, Gammy. Um, anyway, what I was saying is they might have the same picture that's on, uh, their website, but if you look at the sizes on them, they're going to be different. Now, these are your $25 ranges. Most of them are kind of like little kitty pictures. Uh, Elmo, Snuffleupagus, um, you know, what have you. I like her. I think she's cute. Uh, also here is... Now these they they have uh, fairly new releases on their website, but I would say again double check uh, your sizes. Also make sure they're not partials. Okay, um, the stained glass one's really pretty, um, and then I don't even remember seeing the mouse and the bee on Diamond Art Club at all. I don't remember seeing this one on their website at all. Uh, there's a couple here that I don't remember seeing on their website at all. But they actually have a, um, a cropped version of that sneaky cat that we were talking about earlier. I think that's on their Amazon site too. I saw that yesterday. Uh... I know that there this one here is cropped because there's three of those. Um they do have a couple of the bigger ones. They have a couple of Mika Jelinas. I think there's a um there's an Ennis one. Now, on if there you too. look, okay, if you look at that looks fairly good for it being the size that it is. Okay, so I mean, you know, you can't throw you can't throw rocks at it, but um, they got this one here, and I seen like the expensive ones. Um, that one's that one's pretty old. That one's from two years ago. So are these here? So is the cow. Um. I thought this one was pretty cool. Uh, just, I remember this one here with the butterflies. I don't remember seeing the unicorn one on Diamond Art Club. I don't remember seeing this on Diamond Art Club. Tom and Jerry. Now, that's the $64.99. Okay. So, you've got your expensive ones there as well. Uh, and then you've got, you know, uh, Art Artemisa. I have this one right here. Um, so, 
So they do have the bigger, you know, um, diamond paintings, and they have a lot of Randall Spangler as well. Uh, so, you know, I always thought this one was so pretty. Uh, the colors in it are amazing. And then they got the Mrs. Haversham, which she was like 80 bucks in the very beginning. I don't know if they chopped it or cropped it or what, but now she's down to 67. Um, Tweety Bird. Uh, Tweety Bird was it more expensive on a website. Now, I do have all of the Suicide Squads. I don't think I have this one here. But it was just like, yeah, I got my Jared Leto and I got my, my Harley Quinn. I can't see paying $94 for Wonder Woman. That <laughs> is why. Why? Can somebody explain to me why they want $94.99 for Wonder Woman? That does not make any sense to me. Not to mention, I know that there is a lot of geeks out there that are having a fit because I don't think Superman and Wonder Woman ever had an affair. Because Superman... That's outside my wheelhouse. Superman was in love with Lois Lane. He didn't have anything to do with Wonder Woman ever. And I'm not even a DC Marvels, whoever these people are, fan. I just know that he always had the hots for Lois Lane. So why is he kissing on Wonder Woman? Were they part of like, was there some kind of Justice League or something that they were part of? Uh, I'm yeah. really not versed in my comics. I'm not either. But I, I feel like they were in an animated. Yeah, Justice League. That's what this one here says. Yeah. So I think they were together, like in that universe, but not together, together. Honey, that picture right there is them together. I, I know. I mean, but in the within the comic book universe. Oh, yeah. I don't, um, I don't know. But, you know, again, they got the Harry Potter. They got the Justice League stuff. Um, You know, oh, there's your cat. Is that your cat? Yeah, yeah. It's just a cropped up, ver cropped in version. It's really cute. I think that one. Is that like I like that one. Funny? That one looks like it's got a lot of good confetti to it. Minus the colors, it looks like one of ours. I like I like this one here. This one looks like it'd be pretty good. Uh, I can't remember if it's round or square, though. Um, and a lot of the SpongeBob. But anyway, what you guys are looking at right this minute, all of this is on Amazon, okay, Diamond Art Club uh, website. They got new arrivals. Again, just, you know, go across the top here. Um, and, you know, they've got everything that you can think of. Um, let's see what they got for accessories. Um, I don't get it with the pins. Those are just too damned expensive. Um, not to mention this. This is some kind of powder or something. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, there you, ow, there you go, guys. That is kind of the, you know, uh, what's going on that I've learned this week. So, you know, I mean, there you go. So now you can buy, um, give me a clear studio moon goddess. Okay. Uh, the Joker one would go well with my new pen. Uh, I have the Joker. I, I when they, honey, they didn't even come out. Look, Jared Leto, look, he can put his shoes under my bed any day. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. 
So I bought that strictly just because of who it was. And I watch Suicide Squad at least once a week. Um, and the cat is called Abstract Cat. It is a different one than Sneaky Cat. Ah, thank you. Brian. I get those mixed up all the time because they're very similar. That's, I yeah. mean, the Sneaky Cat, I think, has is the one with the tail. I don't know. I just seen Sneaky Cat at uh, Hobby Lobby as well. Mm. Uh, yep, and you can use coupons. Uh, it was it was forty or fifty percent off at Hobby Lobby last week. That's where I get all my tubes from. Is from Hobby Lobby. They're seven ninety nine. Uh, you know, when you get a diamond painting from someplace and it comes in one of them Chinese boxes, you know, I always just go and stock up on tubes. Talking about the other Joker painting, uh, I have the Suicide Squad one. Oh, okay. All right. Gotcha. They've even got a light pad. Wow. I didn't even know they sold light pads. They got a light pad. <laughs> but uh, anyway, that is um, Oh, let's see. What did you send me? Strawberry shortcake. Yeah, that's what I found. I just don't know if that's sold out or if it's a coming soon thing or well, currently unavailable. I don't know. I'll keep an eye out for it. If I see it come back, I'll let you know. Um, Welcome back, Sandy. Welcome back, Sandy. So, uh, anyway, uh, Julie Anderson, welcome to Phoenix Fantasy Group. Ah, uh, did I? Yes, I did. Uh, anyway, guys, uh, Phoenix Fantasy Group is here. Um, there you go. And uh, we have that. We also have our Phoenix Fantasy Chat. Uh, uh, nope. Reload the page. Reload. There we go. Um, and we also have Phoenix Fantasy Chat. If you are not uh, subscribed, go ahead and subscribe now. Uh, I think you have to be a member of the group to be in the chat. I'm not quite sure how that all that works. It'd be a thing. Uh, anyway, is there a uh, matter of fact, I had to recreate it because stupid me deleted it the first time. Okay. Uh, when in doubt, don't click the button. Okay. If you don't know what the button is, don't click it. <laughs> I clicked it. I, I, I didn't even pay attention to my own, my own rules. Uh, but anyway, guys, uh, I think that is going to be it for me tonight. Uh, we've been live for four hours and 41 minutes, and I would like to say thank you to uh, Kevin's wife, Erica, <laughs> for being here and spending the night with me. It looks like all my mods ran off and left me. Cindy is still hanging around there somewhere. Um, but anyway, um, you know, you guys, if you need anything, I'm a shout away. Got any questions? Again, I'm, you know, I am literally a message away. That is the fastest and the easiest way to get to me is through Messenger. Uh, Mr. Night, Eden. Night. Good night, my night. Love you. Ah. Mr. E has been doing Etsy emails. Um, so, uh, you know, there you go on that. And, uh, message request do i got any message request uh no okay no message request okay uh always remember too i wanted to let everybody know if you message me and you're not in my friends group or friends list what's gonna happen is your message is gonna automatically go into what is kind of considered like a spam folder kind of thing 
So uh, I friend everybody. I'm not snooty. I'm not one of these people that don't friend nobody. You know, I look at it like this. I let you in. I can kick you out just as fast. So, you know, if you're going to show your ass, you know, I can, I can put you out just as quick. Next, both of my brooms are still standing. Really? Stan Sandy did the broom trick. Okay. Both of her brooms are still standing up by themselves. <laughs> and have been for 24 hours. We what had that it? for a couple of days. What is that, Sandy? They say the moon. It has something to do with the moon or something like that. But that's like royally cool. Um and uh, you know that you need to you need to do a video of it uh you know and or or do something i'm surprised it ain't all over wherever but anyway guys um erica thank you for being here tonight uh y'all go me. check out um kevin's creations and her little her little I don't know. It would not like slip out of your hand if you went in, in uh, playing with it. Yeah, diamond painting with it. I don't know about, but oh, it's definitely not for me for diamond painting. But yeah, and I'm in either. I'm a hard presser. I'd be done ripped a hole in something. Uh, but anyway, guys, go check out uh, uh, Kevin's Creations Store dot com on uh etsy um you know they're gonna be at a couple of shows uh if y'all are interested in that also go check out their facebook group uh and you know so uh, you know thank you for coming and hanging out with me tonight and uh Honestly, if it wasn't for you, I wouldn't have been here as long as I have been because I would just go, hi, people, here's a wheel, here's a wheel, you won, you won, and it's mine, <laughs> you know. Um, but you, now you got I, to show off all your cool stuff. Well, there you go. Uh, because this was just one of those nights, you ever just have one of those nights where it's like, I'm tired, I don't want to be there, you know. But you made it easier and better for me. And thank you, everybody, Aww. for you as well. Uh, you guys were, you know, a, a big, huge help of keeping me awake. Um, because it was just like, I I could have took the night off and just turned around and went back to bed. But uh, anyway, is there anything else you need to say, Mrs. Kevin's wife? Nope, we're good. All right, my darling, I love you. I look forward to talking to you uh, Sunday, Monday, whenever. Yell at me whenever you're ready. Okay. All right, baby. Toodles. Right. See ya. Bye, guys. Bye. Okay, and I need to fix my thingy. There me is. Okay. Anyway, guys, um, uh, um, uh, I am going to kind of keep this short, sweet, and simple because I really am. I don't know why I'm so tired. I know it's been a bitch of a week, and I have just not slowed down. Um, and I think that's just part of the reason why I'm tired, and I'm hungry. Uh, so I am going to go in there and get my hubby to, uh, to you know, make me some din-din. Um, and, you know, get me some, some good old, uh, Hey, there ain't nothing better than potato soup or, uh, potato garlic soup on, on a cold night. Uh, he swears up and down. It's hot outside. But me, I'm sitting there. I got on three pairs of socks and I'm freezing my butt off. So, and I got on two shirts and a hoodie, um, and, and a blanket across my legs and my butt's freezing so then that's the only part that ain't covered up is my butt but um anyway guys as i always say hey this week you know pay it forward um you know i challenge everybody every week and you know uh pay it forward and you know if you leave a comment on on what you did you know um 
who knows? I, I I might you know pick a pick a comment and 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 send you a special surprise gift. Uh, cause I always love reading my comments and I always love reading you know stories about how how others help people's lives. You know, because here's the thing: one, when you pay it forward, um, you're doing something for somebody without asking for something in return okay you do it because it's the right thing to do you do it because it spurred a moment and you see somebody needs some help um so anyway you know it's just one of those things that um you you know I don't know. It's a nice thing to do. And honestly, you know, one act of kindness can change somebody's entire life. So I, I have said that I have had it happen to me. I know a lot of people that it's happened to. So again, you know, that one act of kindness can literally change somebody's entire life. So that is my challenge to you for the week. Uh, you know, when you stand at Walmart and the little girl's yelling and there's 99 yards of crap going on, just take a deep breath, inhale and exhale, in with the good chi and out with the bad chi, as they call it, and, you know, try not to kill a little kid stand on the end because of the fact that, you know, hey, they, you know, you could, uh, if anybody's there in the first place, because honestly, Walmart's become a ghost town in the first place. Um, but, you know, they're, they, they work just as hard as everybody else. And so, um, you know, thank you guys for being here. Thanks to everybody that are Patreon members. Thank you for your support uh, for through YouTube, joining YouTube. And thank you for the super chats. And, you know, thank you for showing all the love and the kindness. Oh, and again, uh, please pass it on to your friends that now, if they live outside the U.S., they can get their diamond painting trays. Uh, at diamondpaintingfanatics.com um, and uh, along with don't forget to pick up a diamond painting while you're there uh, because they got Travis and everybody else which by the way we have to say keep Travis in our hearts bless his little heart he's got he come down with a flu and come to find out it's COVID so he snuggled up warm in his bed and Mwah. we love you travis and big hugs and kisses to travis and we hope that he gets to feeling better so anyway and cindy michelle you sleep well my darling i think she passed out on me tonight all of my mods wherever you guys are at uh i hope you guys had a good time i know don marie is out of town i believe with uh diamond painting nana Happy birthday again to Diamond Painting Nana. Sandy Chan, I love you. Let, let me know how long your broom stand up there, honey. Um, and anyway, mwah, good night, guys. And I believe that I am fixing to say peace out.